YouTube's volume slider sucks. Alright, so that's definitely the best track from the from Persona 4, I think. Reminds me of some songs from some older JRPGs is pretty good. Every day is great at your June ass. Alright, let's reload for reset. Do 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 Bum bum I think Waffles from Persona 5 would be a better match for Rise because he had Batman voice, so it would be the Dark Knight Rise's, for sure. We didn't really give Waffles from before a Batman voice. Why did everyone think Marie was worse girl? There's way worse girls in the game than, than, than Marie. Don't get it. Who the young mother? Um, I. You me. Chili. <sighs> Chili's fine. Just kind of a. Just kind of a waste of a character. Should have spent more time on Chili. Do 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 Shoes mom Do 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 All right, it was this one, right? So for all of you who are saying during uh, the end of last stream that the bait was too obvious and it was a waste of time, I hope you enjoyed that resolve crumbling more and more over the past 30 minutes. Hope you enjoyed that experience. We were ending at 6 hours yesterday no matter what, weebs. The opportunity was there, it was going to be taken. Thank you, Tracksuit, for the 313 sub. Thank you, Load Galax, for the 713 sub as well. Thank you, Snack Muffin, or some say Snake Muffin, for the 513 sub. Thank you, Grootsiaus der Schweiz. Hopefully that's somewhere close for 2713 sub. Thank you, Tahervon Bonsai. Tahervon Bonsai? I like the word Bonsai for the 613 sub. Thank you, Tater Toga for the 113 sub. Thank you, Dirkashade for the 3213 sub. And thank you, Loner Archon for the 1413 sub. Thank you very much. We almost didn't stream today though, um, because uh, I didn't get much sleep um, until pretty late. And I actually, I actually woke up when the stream was supposed to start, and I'm like, uh, maybe I'll wait till tomorrow and let it go a day. And I was like, hmm, nah, I don't want it hanging over me, and I feel like that coat that would be kind of lame. Um, but like, if I start half an hour late, then it's like, ah, eh, that that kind of sells a little bit. So we just went, we just went for it. Did you get any hostile DMs because the bait? Nope, not a single one. Not even from Trump W. Nope, not a single one. Do, do, 
do 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 Actually for actually for real, yep. I mean I didn't read all my DMs, I never do. I just kinda just kinda skim them. Sorry if that's rude, I just I just get so many I can't I can't read them all in depth, especially cons considering sometimes I get Bibles from people. And I appreciate the Bible, so you know, respect for you know wanting to, to write so much. It's just um, I used to respond to almost every single DM I got, and the problem is, is not so much responding to responding to all the DMs. It's when you respond, it's like rolling a dice on will you get a response to the response. And when people see that you're responding, it makes them want to type more, and that makes sense completely. Like if I was in that position, I would probably do the same thing. Um, but then it can spiral out into so many different DM threads being maintained over a long period. Um, I actually lost quite a bit of time to that when, uh, when Discord was first a thing. Um, for a, not a long time afterwards, but you know, for, for too long I answered all my DMs meticulously. Um, or most of them, I should say. Uh, and it just takes too much, too much time, unfortunately. <clears throat> Have you watched the Persona 4 Him Daisy parody? I don't know what that is, sorry. Anyway, sorry, I'm drinking some coffee and, you know, just walking around a little bit, settling into it. Have you heard of It Takes Two? If so, would you play it? Uh, I think we saw a trailer of that when it was announced on stream. We were streaming when, um, whatever, like the Game Awards or whatever. Uh, it looks interesting. Uh, I don't think I'll, I'll stream it, and I don't know if I'd play it. It's specifically a cop game, right? Uh, I don't think Lily would be interested in playing that. Uh, Lily doesn't play very many games. Like I think Lily would want to play some more games before you know we, we, we go for something like that. Um, I don't think Lily's comfortable um, playing a game on stream. Um, uh, so I don't know. I'm interested in checking it out. I heard it has a kind of a, a couple of um, hmm moments. Bought any Dogecoin yet? It's an XG enemy. I, I saw that, yeah, I saw that. Flashback to, to when I was like, hmm, maybe I should buy a Bitcoin. <laughs> when it was really fucking cheap. <laughs> nah. Alright, should I buy a Dogecoin right now? Nah. Nah, it's alright. Do, 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 do. Would you watch a compilation of Chat Upon in the anime to get a better opinion of this type of character? Um, I mean, sure. Like, if, uh, if I had nothing better to do. <laughs> uh, I'd be interested in the Persona anime, right? Is Persona 4 anime done? Persona 5 anime was, was, uh, was bad, wasn't it? Or did it not get finished? I can't remember. What's the greatest vegetable? Potato, potato. Donkey has been streaming at Takes Two with, with uh, Leah. How how are Donkey streams? How is Donkey live? How is a live Donkey? Pretty boring. Not gonna lie. He's okay. Very low key. Is he? I always find it interesting when uh, the more, I, I wouldn't call Donkey high energy YouTube. He can get high energy YouTube, but higher for sure. I always find it interesting when the higher level um, content creator, you go and watch their, their streams and they're a lot more somber and, um, you know, mellow. Makes sense.
cooperatives too with Mandy or other YouTube creators. Uh, that would that would require me to have friends in, among YouTube creators, and uh, nah, unfortunately no. Like Mark Brown, I don't think Mark Brown is high energy in his in his videos. Um, not low energy for sure, but I don't think Mark Brown is like uh, like like a donkey. I don't think I ever watched one of Mark Brown's streams. Wait, give me a Crystal Kit streams. I think he streams on YouTube. I have seen an announcement for it. I must have checked it out at some point. I must have clicked on it and been like... I did, I remember. He was playing... Super Mario Sunshine. I'm pretty sure he was playing Super Mario Sunshine. And I was like, oh, it's Super Mario Sunshine. What a shit game. Do 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 Anyway, let's get on with it. Let's reload for Risa. Thank you, Sister Chief, for gifting us up to Baited again. There we go. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Thank you very much, Sister Chief. Thank you, Zorax, 100 bits. Thank you, Falzar25, for the 41 3 sub. And thank you, Murder of Phoenixes, for the 2 1 3 sub. Thank you very much. Um. I, I cannot remember her name, but the girl from, from Phoenix Wright is crying over that username. Amy? What's her name? Maya? Missy Maya, Missy Maya, Missy Maya, that's it. Maya, alright. Fe February 14th, alright. Today is Valentine's Day. You received one text message. XOXOXO, Senpai, XOXOXO, you know what day it is. Keep your afternoon open. Spend time where you sit. It's just, this is just so brutally cold yesterday, wasn't it? <laughs> yes. You decided to spend the afternoon with Rise. Yo! Yo, Waffles. Things were tough yesterday. I never thought I'd get zapped by lightning in real life. Thanks to that shock or whatever. I totally forgot what today was. Are we going to talk about the fact that she can use lightning or no? It's over 14th, you know. I didn't have much time to prepare myself for this. So I've been nervous all morning. Uh, someone help me do something about all this pressure. Because she could be pretty, you know, instrumental in, in the case against Sadachi. But no? Alright, believe in yourself. Calm down. You're right. I shouldn't give up until the bitter end. Wait, is this something that I can't change on my own? If I end up just getting friend chocolates and those only from Teddy, I'll never live it down. Hey everyone, they posted the test results. Uh, the awful moment of truth. I want to check it out. Can't believe we're only in the top 10 because we got one wrong. Who's getting perfect all the time? but not getting perfect when we get perfect. Doo -doo -doo. Your score is in top 10. Wow, nice, good going waffles, you're so smart. Social link, blah, 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 blah. Lunch break's almost over. Doo -doo -doo, doo -doo 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 After school, more sensitive than usual. All right, let's see if there's anything huh? new. What should I do now? I'm gonna hang out here for a bit longer, but I don't know what to do. I don't like there's anything for me to do at home anyway. Oh, I got it. I'll go up to the roof or something. I'm, I'm gonna be behind the school building. You know, just because. Most of the girls are already gone. Hey, man, all these guys are obsessed with chocolate. I love kanji. They want candy so much, why don't they just buy some themselves? Are you serious? This is the one day you shouldn't be buying chocolate for your- Yeah? Man, you're clue- From who? Part-time workers at Juness. The important thing is that I have any at all. Right, Jason? san Yukiko-san? 
I see you've got some big bags with you today. So I don't understand this exchange. Like, why does Yukiko put the chocolate down and then run away and then Chili does the same? Were they embarrassed to give the chocolate out or or what? I guess so. Just just awkward anime stuff. Wow, that's not the sound of desperation or anything. Yeah, I do have some. Right, Yukiko? Oh, yeah. Oh, sweet. I like candy. What makes you think it's going to you? It might be for me. I think it's another flaw, and for some people it won't be a flaw. I think it's another flaw in both games, actually, that because the 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 girls have to all be romanceable by waffles is that they can't pair off with anyone else. Like, there's never going to be a storyline where Yukiko finds a boyfriend. You know what I mean? Or, or will pair up with, like, Yosuke, like, assuming there is some attraction there. So, I don't know, I, I kind of feel like, but this would be a different, different, um, error, or a different flaw. Is like, at, if at the beginning you, you'd have to, like, like, um, flag your, your romantic interest in some of them. I mean, I guess maybe you could still do it, but you also just want to, you, you want to spend time with the characters first before you decide that, right? So that would be another mistake if you have to decide before you even get to know them. But I do think it would be more interesting is like if you were like, okay, uh, there's, I'm not going to romance Yukiko or Chili, you know, and then they had a, they, they could be free to have their storyline go somewhere else. It's, it's kind of gross as that sounds too, because it's like, oh, their romantic interests have to like be in orbit around your choices. That's kind of like, eh. but at the same time, I think it would just be more interesting, you know, to have the possibility be there and them can also, you know, go and do other things. Maybe you have to choose your romance interests early, like the whole party's there. Like, when did, um, when did Naoto join? Like maybe shortly after Naoto joins, you have to like declare your romantic interest and then the, the plot can move forward. Don't be so desperate. And I brought some too. It would be held developed for sure, but like most of the game is text, you know, and reusing the same areas and shit and doesn't even have voice acting. So, uh like as loath I'm at, as I am to say this, um, a lot of the game, especially in Social Links, is just is just a visual novel. Um, so I'm not I don't want to downplay it, like how complicated it would be to put it all together, but it wouldn't exactly be expensive. Oh, are you guys handing out chocolate? Great timing. Especially considering to you know the full animated snowboard scenes. You know what I mean? Here you go, Chie Senpai, for always being so hardworking. Why me? Because today's for giving out chocolate to the people you like, right? It's a great day to say thank you to all those people in your life. Not just your romantic partner. Writing is not free. Oh, I know that. But, you know, not expensive doesn't mean free. Relatively speaking, the writing for a game is one of the cheapest parts. Wow. Putting a new spin on things. She's so thoughtful. Must be all those years in showbiz. Where's the hands of chocolate each person? Well, there's any you know, free left for you. Oh no. Hey, what about him? I'll give him his chocolate later. I've got some stuff to take care of right now, but I'll call you. Does that all right, so this wasn't any different. All right. I feel like everyone's super curious about who I'm going to hand my special chocolate to. Who could it be? If I do it now, it'll be embarrassing. So, see you later. So, if you don't romance Rise, is she like does she still give you the special chocolate here and like here you go, I got you a chocolate. Maybe not. Rise gives you a meaningful look. You must go see Rise later. Well, I have some other people to give chocolate to. Bye. Her ability to avoid personal drama is impressive. Oh, not so good. What are you all doing together? What's that supposed to mean? Today's a huge deal. Ah, uh, I see. Well. <laughs> she never breaks a sweat. Well, Kanji, guess we're spending time with each other today. Sure, why not? I totally 
really feel like attention up I have chocolates here with everyone's names on them please take your candy and go home yeah I think she's embarrassed okay well, I... back to the end oh this is chocolate for everyone in Nice visual details there. The Chili's is just a off. just a brown bag. Yukiko has has this this nice you know shopping bag. Well, you don't want yours? I'll take. Do 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 do. You forgot the skip button. No, I just wanted to see if there's if there's anything different, just in case. Uh, we took her to the trash beach. You came to the shore with Rise. The cool breeze feels nice. No one can bother us here. I've got you all to myself. <laughs> Just kidding. Well, well, you do. Here, this is for you. Sorry to keep you waiting. In your swimsuit. The package Rise hands you looks beautiful, but it's giving off an odor that is anything but pleasant. You feel an impending sense of doom. I knew you'd notice how special it is. I added durian and habanero to it. What? Anyone can just melt some chocolate and pour it into a mold. Where's the love in that? What is with with everyone giving these creatively horrible chocolates? So I added a bit of originality. I'm certain you'll like it. What's the matter? It's too pretty to eat. I'll take it home and eat it. It's too pretty to eat. Oh, eat it now. I worked so hard on it. I want to see your happy face. Aren't you glad, Senpai? Of course I'm glad. I'd rather save the best for last. Of course I'm glad. <laughs> Fine then. I forgive you. But you'll have to tell me what you think later. Okay, so these were completely fake choices, right? Alright. He put the chocolate away. Luckily the smell fades when you close the box. The only thing I can hear is the sound of the waves. It's like we're all alone in the world. I'm going to tell you my dreams. I haven't told anyone else. All right, here we go. I want to work and go to college. I think I could study lots of things. And during all that, I want to have a serious relationship with a man I love and get married on a tropical island. And live in a house with a big yard and get a big dog. I'll cook and live happily with my husband. Don't cook, please. And then when we're old, we're gonna drink tea every day by the garden. Together. Oh yeah, that sounds good. With who? Rise is a little embarrassed as she smiles. Just kidding. I'm such a weirdo. I think it's a great idea. Your dream is actually pretty <laughs> I didn't even say who I was talking about. Oh, okay. Now we're playing coy. Senpai? By a man I love? I meant you. Oh, that didn't take long. Right now it's just a dream. But it's important to me. So I want to make all my dreams come true one by one. With you at my side. <laughs> Sling fucking <laughs> playthrough just like <laughs> doesn't say anything. <laughs> Awkward fucking answers when he does. <laughs> Good luck. Good luck. You don't get what I'm trying to say, do you? <laughs> You're supposed to say that we're in this together. <laughs> GG no re. <laughs> the only sound you hear is the crashing of the way. Did you know, Senpai? People were born from the sea. I feel like we're Adam and Eve right now, just the two of us here. Eve was Adam's wife, so... That means Adam gets to have Eve all to himself. No NTR.
You spent a long time with Rise. Oh man, I wonder what they just did. Fucking nothing. Dejima residence front door. Wow, that was a not a good scene. You're late. These games are have long scenes when they should be brief and brief scenes when they should be long. You're late. Alright, so this seems like the same interaction. So let's keep it what it is. No, you're late. <laughs> I don't get it. What? Do you know why? So if you want to see the scene, uh, just watch uh, yesterday's VOD. Thank you. Hold on. Wait, it all? That's incredible. Are you stupid? <laughs> well. The Jima residence, living room. It seems the Jima is away on business and can't come home. Hey, bro. Do you know what day it is today? All right, let's be nice to Nako this time. It's Valentine's Day. Ding, ding, ding. You are correct. This is my favorite chocolate. Nako, you need to blow your nose. Nako gives you some chocolate that is very popular with children. Thank you. It's sweet and yummy. Today, my teacher said Valentine's Day isn't just a day to teach your kids and win everyone. Do, 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 do. I'm proud of you. <laughs> really? And then my teacher was so happy. And then she said, when do you feel like that when I cheer you on? Of course. Me too. When you root for me, I get so happy. We're the same. Is Flowey gonna show up and call us a liar right now? Me, my dad, and your friends are all on your side. Even if you go back soon, I hope you're happy. I have one more chocolate. I made it myself. Uh-oh. Do, 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 do. If it's the same thing, it's same. Okay, I'm skipping. After getting some rest, you have managed to recover your health. The soft light is pouring in from outside. You should hurry to school. Oh, awful kind of morning. morning. Alright, so it's gonna do the zoom out and then uh, we're gonna go hang out with everyone before you leave. And then that's the end, right? Short stream today. Let's have fun. Dun, dun, dun. I thought the reset scene would be like an hour long. Damn, we should have just reloaded yesterday and finished. Huh. What a waste. Dun dun. Dun 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 dun. You have finished packing, you will be returned to the city in two days. You said a rest for today. Da 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 Damn, look at the Z fighting on that sign. I haven't found any glitches this whole playthrough, right? Spring has come once again to Inaba. The 
Kojima Residence. Tomorrow's sign of the day you will part with everyone. All done packing? Well, if you forget anything, I'll mail it to you. Can I go answer the door? Oh yeah, that's right. What do you get at the door, Nanako? I thought you would like come back and show it to us, but you didn't. Sure, go answer it. Hmm. Seeing her so cheerful like that, nothing makes me happier. I already bought your train ticket for tomorrow. It leaves at nine o'clock in the morning from Yasuina bus station. Today's your last day here. Don't worry about Nanako. When you saw you leave her to me. the character model running because of the widescreen and the pet. Oh, yeah, it's true. We did see, see your friends. This might be your last chance to talk to them. This is the last day you will be spending in this town. You should wander around for a while. Oh, man. Yeah, look, she has an envelope or something. Hmm. Are you going out? Be careful. It wasn't a dachi. <laughs> All right. All right. If I go back to the Dima, the Dima residence, it just takes me outside, right? Big bro. Hey. Hey, Waffles. How are you? The good boys coming along. Do you see all your friends? Not all of them. I see. Make sure you don't leave it here with any regrets. Arf, arf. It seems you feel of energy. Hey, can I talk to you for a moment? My mother-in-law, she finally ate my cooking. It was worth staying at home all winter and putting in the effort. I'll keep at it. Oh man, the mother-in-law cooking arc had a good answer. Do, 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 My. My waffles chan. My my, what a coincidence. We really are connected by fate. Chuckle. Should we talk like old times? Sure. Goodness, I am so happy. Aww. I just wanted to visit my husband's grave, then I came to look at the river like I did last time. Next thing I know, here you are. There's a surprise. I live with one of my kids and my grandchild now. They're all so kind. I just realized I almost never talked about my kids with you. Yeah, it's kind of weird. I probably distanced myself from the rest of my family. I was afraid that if I didn't, I was going to depend on them. What? They're living their own lives. They didn't want to be a burden on them. Oh, okay. So I wanted them to forget about me, to treat me as if I was dead. But they they welcomed me, and now we live together. They take care of me, but I'm taking care of my grandson, <laughs> Chuckle. So there's a little bit of give and take there. There really is a place in the world where I belong. I just assumed that there wasn't one. <clears throat> Making one of your in-laws miserable. They're my children. My family. I regret that I didn't talk with them before. My husband's death must have been sad for them, too. After all, they lost their father. Are you happy now? Are you still sad? Are you still sad? Of course. Well... Mm, it's more like there are times when I get sad. I'm so happy right now, but because of that, I feel sad every now and then. I can't help but think he must have wanted to feel this happiness, too. So I've decided that the best thing I can do is live a long, happy life. I'll make the rest of my life as great as it can be, and then I'll tell my husband about it when I see him again. <sighs> then we'll have all of eternity to be happy together. I'm not afraid anymore, just a little lonely. Chuck, I'll also have to tell him everything that happened in town, too. About this whole crazy year, those awful murders, and how the police solved the case. I'll definitely have to tell him all about you, too. I recently realized something. Precious things remain precious, whether you're alive or dead. <laughs> Sorry for making you listen to all my long, all my long-winded monologue. You look like you still have things left to do. You look like you've grown up a lot, Waffles Chan. You're much more handsome now too. Not as handsome as my husband was, though. Chuckle. Whoa. I'll see you again. Well then, take care of yourself. You still have a lot of life ahead of you. You feel a close bond between Asano and yourself. Asano left without looking back. There are others you share a close bond with. You should go say goodbye to them. See you later, River Guardian. There's no reason for you to be here. You feel you haven't finished staying for a while, everyone. Do 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 do. 
Do 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 do. Go to the food court. C can we? Let's go save it first, cause I don't know what's going on here. Food court might end all these interactions, cause that's where we, you know, do our dungeon dives. Not that there's another dungeon left or anything. Do 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 do. All right, let's see what happens. God damn it. Yo. Yo, Waffles. Thought that was Teddy saying that. Sensei, I'm super duper happy that you came to see me. Going around saying goodbye, huh? What do you think of the sleepy, peaceful version of Inaba? It must seem weird to you, huh? I wonder why it began just as you arrived here. I remember that. F I remember that first time. Sensei and Yosuke braving the TV world alone. Boy, I feel so nostalgic. Yeah, ever since then, it was just one surprise after another. Hmm. Can't imagine how it's gonna be like living here without you. A quiet, peaceful town with no need to, to use our personas anymore. I can't imagine it either. That's right, we were right in the middle of this case when you came over to this side. More like, more like the big. Oh, no, 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 it was the middle, because you, when you came over, all right, a lot of stuff's happened. Facing my true self, and you and me got into a fight, too. Yosuke, did you smack Sensei? Ooh, how reckless. Of course, Moron, best friends gotta fight sometimes to be best, to be best friends. Why didn't you say so earlier? Sensei, bring it on, let's fight. Fuck you, Sosuke! I don't hurt him, man. He's gotta get on that train tomorrow. Sensei, you're really leaving, huh? I'm glad I met you and Yosuke. You two completely changed my life. And Nana-chan, Yuki-chan, and the others too. They all helped me. They gave life to me. Life? Come on, man. You were the one who wanted to change. That's why you tried so hard to make it happen. Oh man, how riveting. Thank you so much, Sensei and Yosuke. I love you. I love is kind of strong. I'll take off my outfit if you want. Let's not. You feel a solid bond between you, Yosuke, and Teddy. By the way, is it okay for you to chill here? Don't you have somewhere to go? Like meeting someone? Nah. Do you want Teddy to come with you? Nope. <sighs> no, I think Teddy has to work. <laughs> There are others you share a close bond with. You should go say goodbye to them. Every day's great at your Junas. You should have no reason to come here anymore. You feel like there's someone you haven't said your farewells to yet. All right. I was wrong when I gave him some Valentine's chocolate. The whole village knew about it that same day. I'm so embarrassed and irritated, but the weird thing is I kind of like it. He was a good sport about accepting it, which made the whole thing amazing. All right, thanks for the update. Do you have a Twitter I could follow? I got a lot of new people coming in. Keeps me busy. Now I have to go to my next client. All right. I got a new job from a connection I made while developing new products. I start work again in April. I guess I'll be saying goodbye to this place for a while. That's a little lonely. I met a lot of new people here. I'm very grateful for that. She went somewhere far away, but she'll be back. I believe in it with all my heart. So in the meantime, I'll become a man worthy of her love. Aw oh, man, everyone's at a closing chapter of their life. How convenient. How's our movie coming along this time? I think it's pretty good. I don't I don't know, though. It's at least better than the last one. As long as we try everything. If we fail, we just have to pick ourselves back up. Right, now, what should we watch today as inspiration? A horror flick, a zombie movie. If we're watching a zombie movie, the limited run strawberry popcorn would be perfect. Goodbye, claw machine. 30 frames gives you the hottest new movies and the most addictive crane game. Give it a try. I saw a movie with those three with those three the other day. I suggested we catch a zombie movie and they liked it more than I thought. Hee <laughs> hee. 
It's great to be able to share what I love with other people. Film buff girl, welcome to the Okina police, uh, sorry, Okina station office. Peaceful today, isn't it? I've got my hands full these days, taking in wounded kittens and comforting lost children, but it's okay. Whatever it takes to keep the peace in this town. All right. Do -do hey kid, how are you? It's a mystery. Hey, you'll never be a chick magnet like that. Well, there is such a thing as too much energy. Everything in moderation. That's great, it's the best thing. All right, cool. It's spring break, but school's open to students today. Enter? Yes. Sorry, I just can't stop yawning. Yo, transfer, transfer dude, what brings you here on your day off? Me? Hey, don't worry about me. I'm just getting some stuff set up while I got the chance. Alright, cool. Good luck with that. Now, so why are you at school? Oh, Senpai, do you have business at school too? Oh, that's right, you're leaving tomorrow. Saying goodbye to your teachers? Not really. Having a last look at school, huh? Can I come with you? Thank you for the 8 month resub, Bouncy Bob. Sorry it took me this long to see it. That probably came in after I said thank you to the last uh, last batch. Thank you very much, Bouncy Bob. Thank you, PSL, 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 for the 26 month resub. 26 months, damn, thank you very much. And thank you, Kai, yeah, it's Kai Plays, for the 8 month resub too. Thank you very much. This town has become so peaceful. I know, I just can't stop yelling at it. Oh man, you get some sleep. Well, not that I'm disappointed. It's just that for me to remain here without you or a case to solve seems kind of pointless. I feel somewhat listless. I know this sounds awkward since we've already discussed it before and came to a satisfactory conclusion that the reason for me being here has nothing to do with the case. Perhaps it's just your departure that's making me lonely. I apologize. I'm sorry. I'm making trouble for you. Go see Kanji. I appreciate it though. No, I should apologize. Please don't apologize. I should apologize for asking you not to apologize. No, 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 the apology is for me to do. I'm sorry that I said I should be sorry and you said that you shouldn't be sorry and that you're sorry for it now. It's not your fault for moving home. I'm sure this is hardly the last time I'll face a situa situation such as this in my life. I'll remain here in Inaba, Senpai. Of course, from time to time. My services will be required elsewhere. I'm really sorry, I keep yawning, fucking hell. But Inaba is my hometown now. I want to treasure the precious time I've spent with you solving the case together. The Midnight Channel, Personas, Amino, Sagiri. Who's that? My duty is to stay here and get to the bottom of these mysteries. To be honest, the thought of it makes me a bit lonely. Please don't forget your time here. You feel a solid bond between you and Naoto. I'll be at the station tomorrow with the others. So this is our last chance to talk, just the two of us. No, of course it won't be. I can go visit you anytime, and vice versa. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Senpai, don't you have other farewells to say? Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. I'll see you tomorrow. You have not spoken to everyone with whom you formed a strong bond yet. You should speak to them before your departure. I really, wow. This is just the, the worst yawn you ever had on stream. I'm sorry. Fucking hell. Fall asleep on stream. Do you know if um, if you see or hear someone yawn and you don't yawn yourself, that, that means that you're a psychopath? S rigorous scientific study has come to that conclusion. So good luck. Do, 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 do. It's such scientific that uh, they use it in court. They get someone to yawn in front of the defendant, and if they if they don't yawn, like, whoa, hold on, pretty fucking sus. No one's here. Creepy. <gasps> if no one's here, this is one's bathroom. Even with the courage you have, you can't find it in yourself to go inside. God damn it.
What are they hiding in there? It's carpeted. It's so much nicer than the boys' bathroom. What? I know how to ride a bus. Enter the front, then pay. Or do you get on at the back? What bus am I supposed to be riding? It's not the hospital one or the hot springs one. Mom said a, a bunch of buses come through here. All right. Well, that's, that's the line of dialogue. Now I'm waiting for him. Lately, we've been playing a lot. It's fun because I'm not alone. All right, spacey girl. Whoa, Waffles Cun, you caught me off guard. Haha, -ha. oh, um, I was suddenly, I, I was just thinking of you and you suddenly showed up. So Chili is laughing, embarrassed. Tomorrow's the day, huh? I thought a lot about you and I, I decided to come here. I was thinking, what can I do for you? And I figured crying or feeling sad about you leaving, wasn't it? So I made up my mind. I'm gonna show you what you've taught me. I bought a book. It <laughs> I can read now. It's called How to Become a Police Officer. I told you I wanted to become strong so I could protect what matters, what matters most to me, right? <coughs> well, I want to protect this town. We all worked hard to win this piece. I want to keep it this way. You can't be certain no incident like this will ever happen again, right? This is where all my best friends are. It's where I met you. So I thought maybe I'd become a cop and have Dojima-san put me through the, the ringer. Chili smiling cheerfully. So go home proud. We'll be fine here. Come back anytime. We'll all be waiting for you. In our police suits, you feel a tight bond with Chili. You still have to say goodbye to everyone else, right? Go ahead, go. Chili smiling sadly. There are others you form true bonds with. You should go say goodbye to them. Wow, we don't even like e even Death Arcana had like a a like different scene after interacting. What the hell, Chili? Margaret, you're allowed out. Oh, hello. You have come. I was waiting for you in my velvet room suit. I wanted to see you before you left. Though parting words aren't what I have for you. Remember? The heart is shaken more by a single action than by a thousand words. Do you know what action will shake both of our hearts? A goodbye handshake? A goodbye kiss? <laughs> Chuckle. Yes. For us residents, I'm sure this is a sin. Now, now. close your eyes. Oh, it's happening. Why, you ask? So that you don't witness my sinfulness. Mm. What? What? You feel a solid bond between you and Margaret. Why did I steal a kiss? Is that what you were going to ask? But it's you who was the thief. And they were velvet roommates. <laughs> Will I ever see you again, I wonder? Well then, farewell. There are others you share a close bond with. You should go say goodbye to them. Oh, it's been a while, huh? So, have I told you this? I've been taking walks with that Egyptian woman. She seems to know a lot, and just being with her makes me happy somehow. It isn't very exciting, but it's not bad. Talking to her makes me like this town even more. I came to the country to escape, but maybe I really came to rediscover myself. Ha ha ha! Where's the book guy? You should have no reason to come here anymore. It doesn't let us say goodbye to Daidara? What the hell? Oh, Sensei, what a coincidence meeting you here. What are you doing? Saying goodbye to people. Just walking around. <laughs> you really are strange. Oh, I have a baseball game tomorrow. I'm just warming the bench, though. But it'll be my f Oh, you're like their y Yosuke. It'll be my first game on the team. Haha, <laughs> I'm so excited. Do you think you can come watch us? No. We told him that you're moving out of Inaba tomorrow. Huh? Tomorrow? That's so sudden. I want to see you off, but Shu is panicking. You told Shu that it's okay if you can't come. Oh, okay. Then, can I tell you something I've always wanted to say? I made a friend. He's in the store right now, buying ice cream. It's the guy who transferred here that I told you about before, remember? He's a fun guy, and he's nice. He spoke up for me when I got suspended for cheating. And thanks to him, I have other friends now. He's teaching me about comics and video games, and in return, I help him study. Sometimes we do our homework together. I never thought that fun was something you could have every day. Instead of being afraid and running away, I should have just faced it head on. Applied directly to the forehead. Sensei, thank you very much. Um, your tutoring was great. I really learned a lot. 
Shu smiles at like the happiest kid in the world. You felt very close to Shu. I'm going to hit a home run tomorrow. It'll go so far it'll reach your train. You're on the bench, kid. Please don't forget about me, even if you're far away. I'll remember you too. I'm glad you came to this town. It must have been scary for you, though, with those murders. Those only happened while you were here. Ha ha ha, you must have bad luck. Sensei, thank, thank you, Hick. There are others you share close bond with. All right, that was longer than Chili's. You should have no reason to come here anymore. She isn't here yet. She told me to wait for her. Well, what? It's none of your business. I just want to see her and hang out together with her. Is that bad? Ah, welcome. Going somewhere? Please feel free to buy one of your one of our signature dishes to take with you. You're leaving, aren't you? Leaving me behind. Stupid liar, blockhead. I didn't even want you to save me, and you did. And now you're doing this? I'm going to be lonely. We'll meet again. Sorry. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> we'll meet again. Of course we will. If we weren't going to meet again, I wouldn't let you go. Hey, I went out and got something to eat by myself. Those steak thingies, skewers, whatever they're called. I can I can walk around town even without your help. The bond between us is connecting me to this world. It's kind of lonely, but I'm going to explore the town without you. I'm not scared anymore. If I don't take any steps forward, I won't learn anything. I'm going to find out more and more about this outside world. The next time you come, I'll be showing you around. Marie is acting proud. You feel a tight bond between you and Marie. You're going to say goodbye to everyone else, right? You're always like that. I'll see you again. Thank you. There are others you share close bond with. You should say goodbye to them. It's kind of weird that no one has said, "Aren't you? Are, are, are you excited to see your parents again? Are you are you happy to see them? You know, or any of the other fr uh, family that you have, or anything like that, or you know, like surely Marie could come with us, right? This is the shrine's main building. What will you do? Call the fox. Tatsuhimi Shrine. The shrine seems to be prospering as some objects are shimmering with a golden sheen. You don't see the fox. Perhaps it left. Oh! The fox collapsed. Hmm, what's a young man like you doing in an old place like this? This place was bustling with visitors not too long ago, but these days you see less and less. I heard the town was considering tearing the place down because someone stole money from the offertory box. Also heard some fox had taken up a home here and they were going to haul it off to an animal shelter. Too many rumors these days. Turns out it was just a normal fox. Remember that one about how the fog was making everyone sick? Or that other one. What was it called? Midnight Radio? That was popular with the kids, alright. My grandson and his friends were all into it. Funny, I remember something kind of like that happening when I was a kid too. Wonder who starts these rumors. Oops, I almost forgot. I was supposed to pick up some juice for my grandson. What kind of juice? You wonder if the fox was taken to an animal shelter, as that old man said. He decided to leave the shrine. You feel a presence watching you. It's the fox and its children. The fox family seems to be welcoming you. They look like they're doing fine. The fox's happiness reminds you of the close bond you share with it. There are others you share a close bond with. You should go get you say goodbye to them. Damn, the only character to canonically get busy the whole playthrough. Good job, Fox. Good job. You should have no reason to come here anymore. No, Kanji! Whoa, Senpai, what are you doing here? Kanji seems to be panicking for some reason. Will you talk with him? Talk with of course. Oh, Kanji gets his own scene, nice. Oh, hello, Awful Skun. I heard you're leaving tomorrow. You know, Kanji's been acting all sad and lonely lately. Shut up, you old bat. I told you not to speak to me that way. Anyway, have you told him about the handicraft class? Handicraft class? Thank you for being such a role model for my son, Waffles Kun. Come visit me here sometime, alright? Goodbye now. Alright, well that was an interaction. <sighs> you didn't hear what she said, did you? Handicraft class? Ugh. See, a bunch of customers like those knitted dolls we sold, and they asked me how to make them, so I'm gonna hold classes on how to do it. Laugh it up, why don't you? Laugh, don't laugh. Senpai. It was my decision, though. If people want to learn, and if I can teach them, hell, why not, you know? I'm still kind of embarrassed, though. But, uh, it kind of feels good to do something for other people. Heh. <laughs> it's only because of you that I could face up to who I am, Senpai. Thank you very much. 
Kanji has a refreshing smile on his face. You feel a solid bond between you and Kanji. Are you gonna say goodbye to the others later? Well, it ain't like this is the last time we'll see each other. Our friendship ain't just on the surface. Funny how we got the murder case to thank for that. We put an end to that stuff, right? Adachi's in the slammer and the fog is all cleared up. Still haven't got wrecked ten with Adachi, by the way. It's all thanks to you, Senpai. Yo, Senpai, when you go, don't turn back around, okay? See ya. Alright. How many endings does this game have? There are others you share with a, a close bond with. You should go say goodbye to them. And I don't mean, like, how many different endings you can find. I mean, like, how many times is one path going to end? And then be like, nope, we're still gonna go. Just keeps fucking going. Energizer Bunny of fucking JRPGs. Alright, it's just Resay now, right? Let's go save it. Do, 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 do. Why was that so hard? The nurse? Oh, the nurse, yeah. Can we use the bus? It's bus stop, where you wanna go? Oh, let's go to the Amagi Inn! Oh yeah, Yukiko! I forgot about Yukiko, Inn by Municipal Hospital. Inn by Municipal Hospital. You over here, two nurses talking. Have you heard about Uhura-san? Oh man, how convenient, again. They seem to be talking about Sayako. Psycho. She joined some volunteer organization and went to Africa. Africa? I never thought she'd be the kind of person who would go there. Well, she seemed to be taking her job really seriously towards the end of her time here. She even studied during her break and stopped banging the high schoolers that came in to work as janitors. <gasps> she did? Do you remember when we were talking about the rumors of the Midnight Channel? She wasn't interested at all. Oh, I remember those rumors, not that I know where they started, but yeah, now that you mention it, Uhura-san was never around when we were chatting about them. She was studying some foreign language, wasn't she? She was trying to learn English and some African languages. She read a lot of medical books, too. I see, but why Africa? Why'd she join a volunteer organization? What's the point? I'd rather marry a guy, raise kids, and be an ordinary housewife. That's what I used to think, too, but watching Uhura-san... Make, kind of made me feel different about it. She did seem to have a boyfriend though, a very young one too. Oh, it must have been that kid who was working here part time. Oh, there he is now. I don't know the details, but he seemed to really mean something to her. Did we? She once told me that she was trying to do her best to live up to him. Did she? What? Do her best, eh? I feel I have to try harder too, says the slim nurse. Yeah, I'm starting to see where she was coming from. This is just the worst social link. Let's get back to work and do our best. It seems that Psycho is working hard in a foreign country. Even though Psycho is gone, her life has ch here has changed people for the better. You feel a close bond between Psycho and yourself. Because you're both Psychos. You Psycho back to the town. God damn it, what a waste of time. Do 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 do. What a waste of time. Thank you, Ingvar Fed, for the 38 month resub. Thank you, Balder, for the 8 month resub. Thank you, Gian Lucanjelly. Jean Luc and Jelly, hopefully one of those for the 8 month 3 sub. And thank you, TC Hokies, for the 2 month 3 sub. Thank you, and Invarfed, Balder, Jean Luc and Jelly, and TC Hokies. Hopefully, I said those right. Thank you very much. There are others you share a close bond with. You should go say goodbye to them. Alright, Yukiko. My god, we get to go to the inn. Great inheritance. The Amagi Inn. Welcome to. Hmm? Waffles Kun, that's right, you're leaving tomorrow. Thanks for coming to see me before you leave. I'm very it means, happy. It means a lot to me. I, I was thinking of spending today as just another day. Helping with the housework, taking a long bath, and going to sleep. So I can I can say goodbye without crying. Chuckle, but I failed miserably. I kept thinking about you. And on top of that, here you are, right in front of me. You're not helping at all. You're so mean. Oh, do you think I'm here to see you? I just want to take a dip in the hot springs before I go. Had a good class with you, by the way. That's it, I'm leaving town with you tomorrow. Whoa! <laughs> Chuckle, just kidding, for now. You know, after I decided to stay here and become the manager, I realized how afraid I was, whether I could meet all the responsibilities, whether I'll be able to support the whole staff on my own. I never thought of things like that, but I've made my decision. Now I have to make an honest attempt at it. I'll do my best to overcome the fear for the right reasons. 
and you'll be in my heart while I do Waffles Kun. We'll be together, even when we're apart. I promise I won't turn away from my problems and fears. I'm going to meet every challenge head on, apply directly to the forehead, no matter how hard it seems. Remember when Amino Siguri said, Who? If. If mankind's high wisher, the heirs of the Yeah, I didn't understand either. That's not what I wish for. I'll face myself no matter what happens. Thank you. Waffles Kun, thank you. You'll forever be my precious friend. You feel a solid bond between you and y you and Yukiko. Um, well, I should get back to work. I'll see you later. I'll see you tomorrow. Say so goodbye to Igor. It won't let me go into the room. I can't. Maybe I have to talk to everyone first. Oh, senpai. Where are you going? I came to see you. Senpai, no, that's like you came to say goodbye. I'm not planning on letting this be the last time we meet. It does make me sad, though. I told you before, right? I'm returning to showbiz starting spring. I went to voice training today to, to prepare myself for that. You see, I'm re-debuting myself with a new album. I'm writing all the lyrics myself. Oh my god. Well, I got a D in composition, so they aren't exactly masterpieces. But, you know, a lot of stuff happened while I was on break. I made friends, dear friends. Everyone was so nice to me. I want to express that to everyone who will listen. My deepest feelings in my own words. Ah, uh, I'm scared. I'm scared of putting the real me out for out there for people to see but I can't give in to that fear right I'm all work hard for all my fans out there I'm gonna make a huge comeback so wish me luck of course it'll be lonely of course of course giggle thank you senpai I know that you'll be watching me on the other side of the camera I'll keep thinking that way as I work sounds hot you feel a close bond between you yourself and Rise. I look back at Juness now and I feel all these good memories of us maybe I'll offer to appear in a commercial for Juness then You'll all remember the times we had every time you see it. But then, we'll all feel a bit lonely afterwards, huh? Senpai, I'll see you tomorrow. I'll say goodbye and I won't cry. You will. I'm so glad that fog's gone. I mean, it's still foggy over in the other world, but it's a clear blue sky over here. We can see you off on a happy note. Well, see you later. There are others you share a close bond with. You should go say goodbye to them. You recall that you haven't seen Ko and Daisuke yet. You happen to recall that you went to Aya with them. Maybe you should go to Aya in the shopping district. Oh, can we go see the Dara now? All right, I'm going, I'm going. You hear Daisuke and Ko's voices coming from inside the restaurant. Enter, don't enter. Why are these guys lost? <laughs> what a coincidence. We were just talking about you. Why don't you join us, man? Well, you see, we started talking about whether or not all the crazy stuff that happened here was really over, and we were consoling each other about you leaving tomorrow. Why you gotta blurt that stuff out? That's embarrassing, man. To be honest, though, I did want to see you one last time, but I figured you'd be too busy. Where's I? The next thing I know, you walk right in. It's like, man, I was being thoughtful for nothing. <laughs> you shared a joyful moment with Ko and Daisuke. And while you're here, let me tell you something. After I graduate, I think I'm gonna go to college overseas. Not only does this sound like a blast, but I think it'll look good on my resume when I join the society, you know? I figure that'll help out the Itchy Joe family too. Come on, you're not doing this for your family. I know, it's for my own sake. It's not for the family that took me in, or because I'm their first son. I want to support the family in my own way. I don't need to be the head in order to do that. For the right reasons, that's why I think it'll be cool to study overseas. I'm sure I'll learn all kinds of things I couldn't overhear. <laughs> of course, Daisuke's gonna be a loner. Ha ha ha! Not really. I'm coming with you. No matter where in the world all of us are, it won't matter. Friends are still friends, even when you can't see each other all the time. Yeah, that's a crock of shit. What? <sighs> Those were some touching words, man. To tell you the truth, I had a hard time just thinking about how to start this conversation. I was even thinking about hopping on the train Waffles will be on tomorrow so I could tell them all about it. <laughs> do, 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 do. Haha, ha, that doesn't sound like a bad idea. Why don't we go go we go get some some ramen? <sighs> um, waffles, you can come back and visit anytime you want, man. This is your hometown now too, you know. Not really. No? You feel a close bond between Ko, Daisuke, and yourself. I'm sure you've got other people to say your goodbyes to. We can see you off tomorrow, but uh we'll always be friends. We'll always be friends too. 
Me too. And all you guys, hey, don't steal my lines. I'm gonna make you eat pickled bamboo shoots. There are others you share close bond with. You should go say goodbye to them. You should say hello to Dojima and Nanako. You should visit the, the Dojima residence. All right. Do 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 do. Do, 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 For some reason, I feel compelled to save it. Do, 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 do. It really feels like we should be able to speak to Igor. Like, why? It... Big bro! Oh, big yawn. Hey, Dojima. Hey. Hey, Waffles. How are the goodbyes coming along? Did you see all your friends? Uh, not all of them. I see. Make sure you don't leave here with any regrets. Alright, wouldn't it just... All of them? We did see all of them, right? I think we did see all of them. Most of them, I see. Did they crawl cry? Let me see your face. Hmm. You look a lot more mature now. We've only been together for about a year, but kids grow up surprisingly fast. Nanako, do you remember what we promised? Take care of yourself, big bro. Don't get sick again. Thanks. I'm sorry. You s I'm sorry. <laughs> Why are you apologizing? Don't look so sad, Nanako. We're all family, remember? It doesn't matter if we're apart. We can go see him when I get a vacation, which is never. Then we can talk about everything that's happened since we last saw each other, right? Mm. Yeah. Big bro. Will you remember me? Of course. You'll forget me, of course. It's a promise. <sighs> ah, come on, don't cry. I'm not crying. This is this is hard for Nanako. What the fuck? Oh well. I guess all kids end up being pushed around by their parents. Same goes for you, Waffles. Waffles, it wasn't all that long, all things considered, but I did enjoy your time here with us. I really do think of you as a part of my family, and not just because you're a part of my family. I'm surprised my sister's kid would turn out to be such an upstanding young man. Haha! -ha. Give Nanako a call sometime when you have a spare moment, and you're welcome to come visit us anytime. I'll leave your room just like it is. This is your second home, you know. You feel a solid bond between Dojima and Nanako and yourself. When I grow up, I want to, I want to marry you, big bro. Aww, <laughs> you're a stud, Waffles. <laughs> sure, Nanako, if he's still available by the time you're an adult. <laughs> well, that would be a long time, would it, Waffles, right? Dojima smiles, but he's looking straight into your eyes and doesn't seem to be joking. Wait, what? By the way, have you ever... Alright. Uh, by the way, have you said goodbye to everyone yet? You still have a lot of time today. Why don't you go around in a bun and see everyone who'll miss you? Besides, I don't think you've really had the whole peaceful small town experience while you were here. Now that I think about it, that case began shortly after you arrived, and it finally ended a few months ago. Basically, it all happened while you were here in Inaba. I guess it was just a quirk of fate. Anyway, you should get going. We'll be going home too. You have to you say goodbye to all the people you have formed close bonds with. You should return to your house to prepare for tomorrow. No! I want to go see Igor! Say goodbye to everyone who's close to you. Is there something you still have to do here? Oh. Pretty fucking sus. Pretty Oh, the claw machine! Yeah! So it seems, uh, it doesn't seem very clear that there is something left for you to do here. I, f I feel like this is kind of shit that saying yes would, uh, just take you somewhere else. And that, you know, the real answer is that you have to go to Jeunesse Department Store, which I have just inferred through chat being just so subtle about it. They kept that close to their chests. Super subtle. 
There's no reason to come here anymore. Might as well stop and enter the food court one last time. Enter? Yes. God damn it! Always the wrong elevator! Do, 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 do. The usual food court. This is where you had, had spent so many afternoons going over the case with everyone. Just sitting here brings back a lot of memories. Do, 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 do. Huh? What a coincidence! It must be destiny! Oh, so you guys came here too! It's our very own special headquarters. There are so many memories here. Yo there, senpai. I thought you'd be here. Do, 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 do. We had a feeling we'd run into everyone if we came here. Do, 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 do. Am I actually upset? Of course not. We were planning on seeing you off at the station tomorrow, but I was feeling too restless, so I decided to come here. Well, since we're all here, why don't we have something to eat? Ooh, let's have steak! Steak! And make Yosuke pay for everything! I came here to reminisce on my own, to have some quiet alone time. I'm leaving. Will you shut up about your steaks? I'm miserable. You reminisce with the others. I really had fun in this world. How is this still going to go on for a whole other fucking dungeon? Dude, your whole existence is about fun. Well, what we've gone through wasn't all fun in games. But I gotta say... I've never felt so fulfilled in my life. And then, from the Among Us trash cans... What? What? What is he saying? Oh, right. The Waffles really wants to stay, and his will is made the fun come back, and we go... It seems we've been working on this forever, but at the same time, it felt like it went so fast. <laughs> we won't ever gather here again like this. Or tear our hair out trying to solve the mysteries <laughs> even if we wanted to talk about it all there were so many extraordinary things that no one would believe us come to think of it for me i think it all started when chie told me about the midnight channel i think i heard about it from her too how did you learn about it chie i guess it was just a random rumor a lot of girls were trying it out. Oh. Huh. I wonder how it started then. Better. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe someone accidentally came across it? Fucking <laughs> <laughs> the icon has a tarot card social thing. <laughs> I am the. 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 the. I the. I the. I the. I am the. I am the. I the. I am the. the. I am the. I am the. I am the. I am the. 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 I never knew I could reach such heights before I met you, Waffle. What? <laughs> the Midnight Channel. You know, that really was the cause of everything. I mean, the fog lifted after we caught Adachi, but there's still a lot of stuff that isn't clear yet. It's still foggy over there, too. Aww. Uh. Hmm. Some weird guy might use it to do bad things again. Uh-oh. Didn't that Amino something monster say it granted us power? Hmm. I bestowed power onto those who could brave the hollow forest. In other words, he gave the power to enter TVs to those who awakened to their persona ability. Hmm. So that he might use us as pawns to enact his scheme. Hey, that reminds me. Didn't your hand suddenly slip into the TV even before anything happened to you? Does that mean you're an exception? Well, wait, then what about Adachi and Namatame? Those two could go inside TVs before all this stuff about personas, right? 
What? Then Senpai and the other two could do it for some other reason? The right reasons. There must be something you're not remembering. Anything come to your mind, Senpai? The fog time. You're the only exception. You had the power to enter TVs before your persona awakened, and the same goes for Adachi and Namatame. You remember that Nanako gave you something this morning as you were about to leave. Wait, what? She gave it to us? A letter? Hey, this better not be another warning. The sender is listed as Adachi. What? This is from jail? Alright, time to rank up as we read this letter. It's from Adachi. I'm sure you're surprised to get this letter out of the blue. Oh, the velvet room's blue. I'm writing this because there's something I need to tell you. Ever since I made it out alive, there are some things I understand now. It's true that my game's over. As you all insisted at the time, I'll abide by the rules of this world. But as long as I'm in stir here, I can't clean up after myself. So I hope this will give you something to think about regarding this case. There's still this feeling I can't shake. It's about how it all started, about that midnight channel. Now I remember, someone told me about it when I first came to town, before I heard the rumors at the station. Who was it? And I was intrigued when I noticed that something similar was written on Namatane's reports as well. It was chilly. But I can't remember who it was that told me. Since Namatame and I both gained our power after coming to Inaba, I have a feeling that has something to do with it. I don't know if any of this will be useful or not, but I hope it can help somehow. There's still more. When I'm here, I think of Dojima-san, Nanako-chan, and you. A lot. Though my time with you didn't seem like much fun before. It's strange. What are we trying to do with Adachi right now, game? Adachi's well-organized words unfold on a piece of stationary paper. Despite it all, I'm grateful to you. Thank you. But let me just say this. You're a dumbass. You take the path you choose, and I'll think about what that means to me, too. I doubt I'll ever see you again, but stay healthy. Goodbye. You sense an overflowing bond from this letter from Adachi. <laughs> You obtain Adachi's letter. Yeah, there we go. Do, 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 do. Toru Adachi Social Link has reached its maximum level. You have mastered the Toru Adachi Social Link. Your, the pow your power to create personas of the Hunger Arcana has reached its maximum. Off the chat upon a link that cannot be broken. Hunger Magatsu Izanagi. Wasn't Izanagi ours? Still, though, the things he wrote, not you. Who did you learn about the Midnight Channel from? Hmm. hmm it's so not very helpful to know that he can't remember who it was. I'm not sure how to put it, but. I kind of know the feeling. It's like... I don't know how to say this. Like something's connecting all these things. Something beyond what we can see. That world. The midnight channel. The ability to enter TVs. They all feel like separate things. You know what I mean? First the rumors. Then the serial murder. Followed by us deciding to investigate the case. If they all really were separate... They wouldn't fit together like this, right? There has to be some kind of conductor behind everything. Igor. So you think the person Adachi mentioned, the one who told him about the Midnight Channel, is that conductor? Uh, did I strike gold again? <laughs> it's seriously just something that popped into my head! When did we first go into the, into the Velvet Room? Didn't we start in the Velvet Room? Does going to the Velvet Room count as being on the other side? Or was that just a dream? 
Maybe they, they also went to the Velvet Room and they just don't remember Adachi and Namatame. Like, maybe that's why we can go into the TV, because we went to the Velvet Room first. Yeah, it starts with the Velvet Room, right? Yeah. Senpai, is there anything like that you can think of? The power to enter TVs where everything about this case started. You learned about the Midnight Channel from Chile a few days after coming to this town when she told you the rumor, but Adachi and Namatame heard about the Midnight Channel from someone immediately after coming to this town. When you think back, you feel as if something happened to you as well upon arrival here. There is something. Yeah, we went into a, the fucking dream thing. We were involved in a murder case last year, which we succeeded in solving. Oh, God. But the monster we fought last said we did well in playing our parts. Oh, I thought he, he said laying our farts. Perhaps this means Adachi and Namatame were players as uh, well. I thought he said flaying our hearts. Perhaps this means Adachi and Namatame were players as well. Could it be that from the beginning, this serial murder case was merely a portion of a much larger scheme? And none of the people who were directly involved in the case ever suspected it. Hey, this scheme... Could it be the whole thing about filling both worlds with the fog and turning mankind into shadows? Nah. So someone was behind the scenes watching us. The culprits. And maybe even that monster. Why don't we just go ask Marie? Marie knows all of it. She remembers everything now, and she knew what she had to do, and she knew what part she had to play in the fog. Let's just go ask Marie. Why didn't we already ask Marie? Why didn't Marie just tell us? Because you never fucking asked, Waffle. Okay. And he manipulated Adachi and Namatame at the very beginning, so everything would come together perfectly? Let's go out into town. We might find something. Like Marie. Although... You may be the only one capable of noticing it. Yeah, there's this room I keep going into in town. Please contact the rest of us should you come across anything. I'm gonna sneeze. We can't say our goodbyes tomorrow with this hanging over our heads. <coughs> Let's go figure this out. <sighs> Who could have given you the initial spark for this power? The one you met immediately after coming to town was... My uncle, Dojima. It was Nanako. It, no, it was... It was Igor in the Velvet Room. Oh shit. In any case, you need to see them for the truth or whatever. Leave Juness. No, apparently you're supposed to go back up. Nope. Go back up later. Do 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 do. Okay, let me see if I can remember this correctly. We we it opens with the, the car ride, right? In the velvet room. That that seems like it has to be it. Like, I don't understand how it could possibly be anything else. But, you know, like, we went to a supernatural car plane um, and spoke to, like, two supernatural entities. Then we got out of, out of the, 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 the train when we got here, walked down the, the stairs, bumped into Marie. But Marie is a golden character, and this isn't golden content, isn't it? Or is it? I, I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's Marie? We have to go find Marie? Then we met the uncle, and then we, we fucking went into town, and we had the, we stopped for, for gas, right? And I thought we were going to get a job for, at the gas station, and that never happened. That was kind of weird. And then we went back to the how the Jima's house, or we didn't go back there. We went to the Jima's house, and we fell asleep. And that's when we had a fight with the person in the fog realm, right? Our persona, right? Was it that? So like, it's clearly going into the velvet room, right? Clearly. I, I, unless this is golden content. If it's golden content, then it's Marie. If it's not golden content, then it has to be going into the velvet room. Why isn't, like, Waffle saying that? Oh, because you can't talk about the Velvet Room for whatever reason. Should we look for Dojima? Okay, I think they're probably going to be at home. Do, 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 They're not home. Floodplain? Nope, they're not here. Well, fuck. All right, maybe at the third river bank. Just check while we're here. Oh God, good thing I did. All right, hey, how's it going? Mm -hmm. 
Mm, waffles. Did you already meet all your friends? I'm finished. I want to talk to you. Hmm? What's this all of a sudden? You asked Tajima about the first day you arrived in town. The day you first came to town? Hmm, let's see. We were the first ones to greet you, right? Nope. Did we stop somewhere on the way home? Marie was there. I'm pretty sure Nanako and I left home that afternoon, picked you up, and came straight back. <laughs> now that I think back to that night, I was called back to work as soon as we got home, so I couldn't talk much. And the very next day, those strange murders started. Sheesh. Lots happened since then. It's been one heck of a year, hasn't it? Hey, Big Bro. On the first day? Didn't we stop at that place? The gas station. I used the bathroom there. Yeah, I remember thinking it weird that you were just like, yeah, just go by yourself and use the bathroom. When I got back to the car, you were talking to the weird attendant. The gas station, the weird attendant. Yeah, when I first met you, I remember the gas attendant because he was weird. Why was he weird? Hmm. Now that you mention it, I do remember that. I filled the tank before we went home, huh? Wouldn't the attendant have filled the tank? Uh, yeah. I, I do remember you talking to the attendant there. Okay. I didn't remember seeing him much before, so he stuck in my mind. Alright, so it's the it's the attendant that is, the, is like, some weird agent? Like, how how is it that and not that we went into the velvet room beforehand? It's kind of weird. But I don't know about calling him weird. It wasn't like he looked or acted funny. Yeah. Come to think of it, I, I never saw that guy again. Mm, it wasn't really that the attendant looked weird, but after you talked to him, you looked sick, big bro. Oh yeah, we did. Yeah, I think we, we felt kind of weird, didn't we? I looked sick. Mm, don't you remember? I asked you on the way home. Are you car sick? Yeah. You said you were okay, but that attendant... He was just a little scary for some reason. Hmm. Well, I didn't know about that. Hmm. All right. Well, that's all right that they like set that up and and they, they know it's it's well hidden. You know, like you don't really think that much about that interaction. But the reason you don't think that much about that interaction and think it's meaningful is because we were because we went in the velvet room and also because of Marie right before that. Eh. Whatever. But honestly, I'm surprised you're asking all these questions. I thought you came here just to reminisce. Not a big deal. So, why are you looking for the person you met first? Is something going on with that attendant? Do you know him? Well, I've seen him around a couple times, but nothing comes of it. Not really, no big deal. It might be important. I see. Well, just remember that you leave tomorrow. I don't know what you're up to, but you should come back home early. Velvet room was before in town. Why, do, why would that matter? There are some dark clouds on the horizon. We might get some rain soon. If you have a secret power to go into TVs that are connected to a realm full of fog, which is what the velvet room is, the car is driving through, and you're one of the ones that has the power to go through, and you're trying to figure out why you had the power for you had the persona, why why wouldn't you just immediately conclude that oh well it's because of because of that like why would you even entertain the thought that it might have been something else without bringing that up? It just it just comes back to the bullshit that um that uh. That is, um, what should we call it? Uh, the, he just won't talk about the velvet room to anybody, anybody else. Now it's time Andachi never went to the velvet room. Waffles doesn't know that. Maybe they did. Maybe they got theirs on the way here, like we did when we were on the way here. I, I assume that the velvet room thing happened, um, while we were in the train, right? On the way here. Like... There are uh, way more reasonable lines of thought to follow right now than what we're doing. Not just with the golden content with Marie either. Go, go ask Margaret. I understand. Wait for me. I understand. Wait for me. Okay. Okay. The first place you stopped when you came to town was the gas station. Maybe something there will drag your memory. Did Adachi and Amatami go to the velvet room? I don't know. We never asked them. Maybe they did. We didn't tell them that we went to the velvet room, so maybe they did. Adachi mentioned that it happened after he got into town, so maybe that's why the so that's why the velvet room before town isn't the answer. Ooh. You know what? I can't be fucked today. Let's just go. I can't be fucked today.
Welcome to the Velvet Room. How may I help you? Got some questions, bud. You have solved the mystery and deflected the disaster that so nearly fell upon you. Is there something else beyond this you need our assistance with? I want to thank you again. There's one last thing. Intriguing. So, is there still something that leaves you unsatisfied? Hmm. What may that be? Well then, let's take a look and see what it is you might be sensing. a lot what are they what are those ah this is a surprise these are shards of power allowing one to see through to the truth of things without being swayed by hollow rumors interesting indeed you have come here today for a reason then I shall play my part as well That is a crystal of power, which you have nurtured through your journey. An orb that repels fabrications of all sorts, dispels lies, and shines upon the truth. Attained orb of sight. Hey, I remembered something about myself. Okay. I was born a long, long time ago. I was the unconscious wish shared by people's minds to protect the world of man, walk the path of man, fulfill the wish of the world. That was my role. But people changed. People stopped wishing for truth and life. Or maybe they just stopped paying attention. Eventually, the me that wanted to protect humanity and the me that wanted to fulfill humanity's wish couldn't stay as one. The desires of man had no bounds and one day, my other half became its own existence, much larger than myself. I was left behind with no power or memories. I became a tiny fragment Incapable of even clearing the fog without giving my own life to do so. Kusumi no Okami. Is that who you're quoting? The rest, you already know. Without my powers, I became a tool manipulated by the other me. You already know, huh? The cause of it all. The one who created the Midnight Channel and gave you the power to enter the TV. God, I hope the eye monster is the one driving and that thing behind Igor just like opens up right now and the big gigantic eye shines through and is like Riff arrive, blah, blah, blah. God, please. The real puppet master who tried to fill both worlds with fog using me and the Sagiri. If you don't defeat her, the world will never be truly clear of that fog. Go. Follow what you believe in. The truth is right in front of you. Truth is a thing which only appears to those who have observed, considered, and made a choice. At the end of the path you chose lies the truth. Believe in it and continue without faltering. <laughs> How marvelous. It seems that you will reveal the journey's true end. One beyond our predictive power. Okay, well... There's only one person it could possibly be unless they're going to introduce someone new right here at the end. Which, honestly, I wouldn't put it past them. Now go! to the place where everything began. It began raining.
Hi there, do you need something? Nothing really. Isn't there? Isn't this where I first... First, what are you talking about? Oh, is this about the part-time job? I'm sorry, you don't have an opening yet. Ah, there we go. Nice, they call back to the part-time job. Go somewhere else. Do you know Namatami? Ah, that serial murder suspect. A real tragedy, wasn't it? But the case was solved, right? Thank goodness. Did those... Have you met those two? Well, that's a weird question to ask. I don't know if it was right here, but I might have met them before. I've been in this town for a long time, yeah. So yeah, there's a good chance. It's not like I knew them personally. If you've got nothing else, do you mind leaving me alone? Oh, you still need something? Hey, I still leave me alone. Did you miss that? I'm done now. Did you do anything to them? Huh? To those two? Ah, uh, that's right. I remember now. I think I met them when they first came into town. So I greeted them saying, Welcome to Inaba. And that's all. Just that. Chuckle. What about it? Oh, nothing. What did you do to me? What did I do? Chuckle. Don't you remember? I met you here when you first came to town and did the same thing as, as what I did to those two. I greeted you. That's all. Remember? We talked for a couple minutes. Hey, mind if I ask you something? Why all these questions? Is there something that's bothering you about the time when we first met? Yes, there is. Who are you? Did you give me the power? Mm-hmm. Ha ha ha. Amazing. You've reached me at last. Chuckle. Let's drop this, sh this charade. To be quite honest, I was waiting for you to come. Adachi, Namatame, and you. It is I who awakened that power within you three, but also the fourth Persona user waiting in the rain. Watch out, because it's Persona 4, the ones who had potential. Uh, having said that, I am rather surprised. You really are troublesome. <laughs> Not only did you defeat the two Sigiri I snuck into Adachi and Namatame, but you even saved that stunted dwarf of a life. Are you talking about Marie? You're the one behind everything. Are you talking about Marie? <laughs> it's such a foolish thing. What good is saving her life? Mole? Wait. Liam! She is but rubbish. Suitable only for getting rid of that pointless fog. Hmm? <laughs> Don't tell me she was still carrying that around. Oh, excuse me. I was talking about that bamboo comb you have on you. I got it from Marie. Why yes, do you laugh? I know. After all, it is a symbol of separation, which is why I gave it to her as we parted ways. Remember that Kanji's mother mentioned that when you visited Tatsumi Textiles and Re what is it? What was it in the, when we went to the to the the school for the trip? Um, what, what, before the weird drunk scene, something about the god or whatever, like with the comb. Is it linked back to that story? It's got to be. It's an old belief that combs have the power to cause separation. How foolish! That comb was a curse, and to think she treasured it all this time. She must have been desperate for something to cling to. <sighs> There's a limit to how irresponsible you can get. No. I will not forgive you. Don't look down on Marie. You messed with me as well. Don't look don't look you don't you look down on Marie. Hmm. And what are you going to do about I'm it? I'm gonna punch you. The last battle wasn't enough for you. You certainly have the powers I was expecting. What do you mean? Why did you choose me? Who are you? What do you mean? I saw the potential you had within you. <sighs> Your friends were drawn to the spark I stirred in you. That's why they're here now, with their awakened powers. Still, I didn't think you'd make it all the way to me. Indeed, I never expected this at all. You're really something. What? You don't remember? When you first came to town, I gave your power a gentle push. Just like this. Uh-oh. Are you in high school? Does it surprise a city boy to see how little there is out here? There's so little to do, I'm sure you'll get bored fast. You'll either be hanging out with your friends or doing part-time jobs. Speaking of which, we're actually looking for part-time help right now. Give it some thought, why don't you? We don't mind if you're a student. You felt an extreme dizziness. You're not the only one I welcome to town with a handshake greeting. I did the same for a few other outsiders like you. 
A handful of strangers were more than sufficient to stimulate a small place like this. A few? But it seems the stimulus was stronger than I imagined. Enough to envelop this town with fog, and later lift it. Not only that, you now stand before me as if your assigned part wasn't enough. What for? To end everything, to learn the truth, I don't really know. To learn the truth. What will grasping the truth do for you? Why such greed? I guess it's the foolish nature of being mortal. I am Izunami. Sure you're not Yarnum? Amano Sagiri, ruler of the fog, is merely an aspect of myself that I birthed long ago. You awakened to a power I had not imagined. You defeated the two Sigiri and the one fragment born from me. And now here you stand, face to face with me. I can no longer ignore this situation as mere foolishness. This may be fate, as decreed by the world. Very well. This time I shall pit my full strength against you. But in return, you must come prepared to follow through in your futile resistance. <laughs> I'll be waiting for you there. In my swimsuit. The one you just encountered was the entity behind everything. Her name is Izanami. You can hear your friends' voices in the distance. Alright. Hey, are you alright? Who was that you were just talking to? Did she just disappear? Wait, don't tell me. You told your gathered friends what happened between you and the gas station attendant. So, it wasn't over after all. You're saying this so-called Izanami is the conductor? And she's waiting for us in the other world? If we don't beat her, I'm sure it'll all happen again. Oh, okay. The others aren't far off, so I'll call them up. Yeah, will ya? Tell him this is really gonna close the case. Will it, though? Are you sure there's not two more endings after this? Right. We'll defeat her and put an end to this for sure this But we time. haven't gone scuba diving. All right. Then once we're all ready, let's meet up at Juness. You have finally discovered the true cause of everything that happened. You must defeat this Izanami who wants who waits for you in that other world. If Izanami truly gave birth to Amino Sigiri, okay. So to be clear, um, uh, I actually quite like that. You know, this encounter that w seemed to be innocent at the beginning is, is responsible for more than than you thought at the beginning. Um, I also have wondered, like a couple times, why we didn't get the job at the uh, at the gas station. I thought that was kind of weird, um, and so that had a double meaning too, because you know, she, like the the part time help that she wanted you for was this this conspiracy bullshit. I'm just annoyed that. Um, Th this was a mystery we needed to solve when there was a much clearer and better answer to follow before we went to oh maybe it was the gas the gas uh, station attendant um, but that actual part is is fine the setup and then the payoff for later oh I'm not too happy that it's more enemy bullshit though but as long as Izanami is left alone the town will definitely fall into the fog again someday and the pacing is just completely off it should have happened sooner. And if that were to happen, everyone, all those precious to you would become mere shadows. This is the most important task you have faced. And it must be taken care of before leaving town. You must ensure complete peace for, for this town where you live with everyone. Do we get more social link time? No. I'm going home. Do, 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 do. You must not leave this town until you defeat it as a Nami. God damn it. What if I go back home? Let's go save it. What's it gonna tell, say to me if I try to use the mini menu? Is it just gonna say the same thing? Yeah, okay. Can we go see Daidara now? Maybe we should go to the development room and tell them what just happened. 
that would be probably important, right? That sounds like information that they need to know. Hey guys, you wouldn't believe what just happened. No? Okay. Your world, will you, will you show it to me? Jeez, you really are stupid. Why are you coming to me at a time like this? I only have one wish. I want you to walk the path you believe in and feel dissuaded. I, no, not just me. Everyone can see you supporting you. Don't worry. I know you'll be able to find the truth. Cause we're gonna shout it loud. Ah, oh, yeah, we can go see that art now. Nice, it's very welcome. On drippy days like this, your heart for art tends to dull. Maybe it's because I don't see many rare materials. Hey, what's the matter? Weren't you going back to the city? Hmm, from the look on your face, I guess you have to score a subtle first. Well, I won't pry. We've known each other long enough that there's no need. Now take a look around my shop. Do, 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 do. Did it put our equipment back on? Oh, that's good. All right, nice. Nice, nice, nice. All right, I wanna go fishing. Hey, dude, how's it going? Uh, it started raining, I don't have an umbrella, dang it. All right, well, why are you just standing in it like a psychopath? Like a fucking numpty, like what the hell? It started to rain, I wonder if she's okay. Uh, it's really coming down, I hope my kid remembered an umbrella. Yes! Do, 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 do. Thank you, Standard Comrade, for the 3 month resub. Sorry it took me so long to see it. We got really into the story there. Thank you very much, Standard Comrade. Hopefully you're still here. And thank you, Username Limbo, for the 15 month resub as well. Thank you very much. Do, 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 do. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. God damn it! All right. This is finally it. This should be voiced. So many things have happened up until now, but now we'll beat this Izanami and put an end to this, right? Right. Yes, but since we were spread out all over town until a moment ago, let's go over what happened. Fucking hell now to- This is the last measure that must be taken. We need to make sure that we end up this properly. Alright. What will you ask about? Izanami. We thought Amino Sigiri was behind everything, but it turns out there was something behind it too, and that something was a guy at the gas station? I can't believe she was disguised as a, as a gas station attendant smack in the middle of town. Does that mean she knew Waffles and Dojima-san would stop by there on that day he came to Inaba? I guess it is the best place to greet people from out of town, but then did she come into contact with Adachi and Naotami also at a different place and disguised as someone else? Who the hell is this Izanami? Izanami and Amino Sigiri. Those names would be familiar to students of ancient Japanese mythology. Huh, you're saying she's a god? Huh, like that's possible. That Marie can literally like summon lightning. That reminds me, remember the persona that Adachi summoned? I don't know how to put it, but I thought it was kind of like the persona that Waffles first called. Izanagi, was it? Izanagi is also the name of a god in the same legend. Since both of them awakened with the same push from the same individual, their power may have been similar. Persona is one's heart given form. The images of gods and mythical beings were created by humans, so if the personas resemble them, there may be a, a connection there, since the enemy reigning over that world calls itself Izanami. Oh yeah, we were taught that Iz Izanagi and Izanami's names originated from the word Izanao, meaning to invite. Maybe I'm thinking too hard about this, but Namatami-san, Detective Adachi, Waffle Khan, and even us, we were invited to play our parts in this case, as if there was some deeper meaning behind it all. Deeper meaning? Hmm, I don't really get it. But if she's trying to mess everything up, I can't let that happen. We gotta defeat her. What will you ask about? It's almost like Izanami is a stand-in for the writers that, wanting things to happen. Oh, it's not that the, the the story needed this to happen. Is it the writers forcing it? No, it was some god that was just moving things behind the scenes. Whoa, that count. The push I got. By facing our own shadows on that side, we awaken to our persona abilities. However, that did not apply to Waffles Senpai. Yeah, even before all this persona stuff, Waffles could stick his hand into a TV. I guess that sort of backs his Anami's claim that she personally awakened his power. Same holds true for Naotami and Adachi. She selected three outsiders to bestow powers upon and watch what would have transpire from there. Well, now we got. Now that we know all this, we just gotta beat the hell out of his Anami. Let's hurry and get this over with. Waffles is going back home tomorrow. What will you ask about? The Midnight Channel. 
The rumors about the Midnight Channel, and maybe that this Izanami was the one who originally spread them. Neither Amino Sigiri nor the Shadows had taken a single step outside the other world. Simply put, the only one who could have spread the rumor was someone who had come from there. The more it got passed around, the more extra junk got added to it, like one big game telephone. That's where all the... That's where all the you have to watch it alone and the one who appears as your soulmate stuff came from. Since it took place on a TV, we never considered the possibility that the images broadcast on the Night Channel could vary from viewer to viewer. But whenever we talked about what we saw afterwards, there were never any inconsistencies. What changed according to each person is was most likely the image's clarity. What? Yeah, I can think of a few places where that might have happened. When Saki Senpai appeared, I was the first one who was positive it was her. For Yukiko, it was Chili. And for Kanji, it was Yukiko that said who the person on the TV was. I mean, it was also super fucking obvious in every... St I thought because of each because each of us had a strong attachment to the victims, we linked the TV image to them in our head. I bet we actually saw a clearer image on the TV than everyone else. No? Then why didn't we see Nanako really clearly? Whatever. The same could probably be said for Namatame. That's why he was always a step ahead of us. What? I thought it was because he knew the area as well as a delivery man, but I was stymied at how fast he identified Nanako-chan. Since he was a savior, he must have seen Nanako-chan's image from the very beginning. What? Alright, but who cares about the details? Waffle Senpai is leaving tomorrow, right? Should we really be wasting time like this? Who has a stronger bond with Nanako? Big bro with rank 10 who's hung out with her like for hours and hours and hours and days really or like one rogue Namatame. Lol, yeah, he's right. Let's hurry and defeat this Izanami. Alright, let's enter the TV. Check the weather report. The weather report, um, let's see. Oh, it's sunny tomorrow. Nice. Do, 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 do. Go ahead and ask. Yeah, let's go. Do, 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 do. I sense a tremendous presence. It's unlike anything we had faced. It's not just the bond, it's whether or not you you want to see them or expecting to see them. Why would Namatame want or expect to see Nanako on the TV? And if, like... Again, whatever. And it seems like a new area has formed. I bet it's that lady. She's waiting for us there. To save her? But that's what we want to do too. So whatever applies to them with time, it would also apply to us because we really want to see who's on the TV too so we can intervene as well. Any argument that's in favor of Namatame being able to specially see people on the TV also works for Waffles and the Scooby Gang. I bet it's that lady. She's waiting for us there. That reminds me. That Amino something we beat said stuff like, We'll meet again. If that thing's gonna show up again, Let's crush him completely, so he can't cause any more problems from here on out. Damn straight. Let's go snap that thing in two. We'll do it and give Senpai a big farewell tomorrow. But we should regroup and come in in the morning. Let's do our best like always, leader. It is kind of sad that this really is going to be the last time we do something like this. You know, this might sound like a weird thing to say, but it was a lot of fun. That's because we all strove together toward a common goal. People died, Chili. There were many things we believed in without questioning them. The culprit's identity, their motives. There were many occasions where we nearly gave up. It may have been easier if we'd chosen to look the other way, but we didn't. Even if we had to fight every inch of our way, I want to go on feeling, seeing, touching and thinking for myself yeah still one person alone can only understand so much that's why we're all here together together right all for one and one for all togetherness so long as someone's got your back you can kick against the pricks no matter how tough they are friendship this is for our future so we can see him off tomorrow with no regrets Ew. Yosuke always has to try to make himself look all cool, but he's so pathetic it makes my skin crawl. Alright, based in Teddy Pilled. Probably just fleas on your ratty old suit. I spilled juice on you earlier. No wonder I smell of orangey freshness. <laughs> well then, let's do this.
So this will be the last time I help you catch the bad guy. So, well, you know, until next time. Good luck. Do, 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 do. Do 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 Are you sure we don't have to go back into town and do an investigation before we can go somewhere? Anyway, uh let's take a break. It's over two hours. I'm gonna go pee and then we're just gonna go. Uh even if this takes like a little longer today, I wanna finish today. Unless there's like ten hours left somehow, you know, because that's a possibility still. No joke. Anyway, uh be back in about um five minutes.
do 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 so do we get money in this dungeon can we do some fusions let's go see if we can fuse Man, I love water. Oh, we still can't make our hello. God damn it. Magatsu Izanagi. Belial Certain Horus. I'm sorry, I have to go to someone one second. Leo's raging about something. All right, sorry about that. Hi, Madoon. Axidute, who calls to me? One who shines in unimaginable darkness, will you even draw on your hollow self for your strength? I am Agatsu Izanagi, I will determine the path you take. Man, how come Adachi's persona got to be way better than ours? This seems kind of bullshit. What does Namatami's look like? Thank you for the five gift subs, Toxel. Thank you for getting us up to Liquid Brain, uh, Fliegerman, Tadashi047, The 6AM Society, and Procyon Cancrivorus? Hopefully I've said that right. Those are interesting names all in a row. Thank you very much, Toxel. And thank you, Mr. Silver Strike, for the 13 month resub as well. Sure. What's it gonna change to? Absorb a lack. Well, that was worth it. All right. So we need level 87 for Halal, and if we hit level 90, we can get a Zhao Gongen. Uh, how much money do we have? Not that much, I think. We should probably fuse some of these together just to uh, just to make these guys, right? Are there any that we already have a start on? Apart from this one, a Mott, a Pazuzu, a Belial. That's not happening. All right, so I guess we're just we're just fusing some of these for for the lols. All right, so Thor, Karikea, 
And you're longer becoming Odin. Let's do it. Odin would be thicker, huh? Joe's a thirsty boy. Always, yeah. Always thirsty. Always drinking water. How to train your bladder. Oh, that was it. Okay, Hachiman and is there one that gets us with a with one that's higher? Say five eighty-seven. Fuck, I'm not getting OC. I guess just fusing these together. We gotta get rid of the low ones. I haven't pissed since last stream, Joe. Respect. Damn, the commitment. Reminds me that um, there was a, a radio contest where when the Nintendo Wii was a big thing and I think it was like they did a contest, hold your Wii for a Wii and it, they had like people on the phone and it was like you had to hold your bladder for who, whoever could hold the longest got to win the console and I think a lady died. One of the contestants died. Yeah. So it just goes to show you, like, you know, train your bladder, but not too much. Okay, I want to go in with, like, next to nothing, pretty much. Yeah, they had not drink water and she got poisoning from too much. Oh, is this she drank too much water? It's not that she didn't pee. Water and toxic. How much water did she drink? Did, did they give her like bad instructions or did she drink too much? I am out of vodka. Our victory lies in your hands. Don't you have to like down like six liters or something in, in one sitting? I drink 10 plus liters a day. I'm not sure if I ever get that high, but I drink a lot, yeah. I'm pretty sure that this I've this this big thermos I have I think is about two liters at least. And I usually drink two of these a day. Um, in addition to some some other glasses of water. I just like to drink a lot of water. Always had. But I don't think I'm at 10 liters now. Do we get rid of the added Vaca and the Metatron for the year longer just to go in completely like empty? No. Kingpin Duster. Where you get this stuff anyway? Hey Kanji, looks like we just found your battle outfit. It's perfect for a punk like you. Shut up, I'm not a punk. 
You kind of are. What the hell makes you think I'd want to wear that? Do I look like I, I'm some asshole who fights all day? Is that is that what you want? You want me to fight? How about I start with you? Hey, wait a sec. This is from that biker gang I busted up. Whoa, you are fighting and you're winning. Hey, what about me? Something for the bear? Nothing? Fooey. What should we wear? I like the hard boiled look on waffles. Yosuke and Chili doesn't matter. Yukiko. Cheerleader outfit or Christmas? Christmas costume sounds fun. Let's, let's be Christmassy. Everyone wearing the Christmas costume. Go to the eerie bedroom. Oh no. You can wear yourself, Senpai? Yeah. <gasps> There's no special one here! Yay! Let's go, everyone. Trippy. Um, Senpai, I know you can do it. Show me one last time that you're the coolest guy in the world. I am. Okay, good luck. What is this place? It doesn't feel anything like the other areas. Whenever we'd go into the, to rescue someone, I could sense their restless heart and how unstable it felt. But there's none of that here. Does this Izanami person not have a heart or something? Who is she? Anyways, be careful, senpai. You know what? I'm good. Let's, for the last one, put them back in their default clothes. Here we go. Wow, these guys are, uh, they're tough. Must be moms. Kanji, that was great! You're the man! So persistent! Should've just Muhammad. You're on a roll, You're Senpai. doing well! Mahama early. Mahama often. Oh, he was humping the chest. Oh, it's another one. Oh, whoa, we to Mahama. Darkness won't work. Keep going, Senpai. So cool, Senpai. You really hit it hard. 
Just... And ready. Yeah! Try the man's way on big crowds. Yeah, we probably should just see what it looks like. Oh. Enemy reinforcements. Huh? Five? The heck? This seems like a big crowd. Let's see if they're weak to Mahama. Do, do, like I'd do, say do, no. Do, 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 do. I'll use my Mahama. Will you use a Margaret boss fight? I don't know if you're kidding. I don't know if you're kidding. Crumb of Yoshi to the Lord, we just, uh, fused him away. Who said Muhammad was a meme? It saves you. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, Muhammad's fucking great. Shocker. Right? Didn't we get one of those from a uh, from the what you call it from the TV? Yeah. Oh. Well, this is very cyberpunk. Break three key card. I think she has one on already, or she has to regen one. I'm not sure. Maybe Nato has it. Looks like that one's immune to wind. Fight the reaper. I'll fight. If we find the reaper, I'll fight the reaper. Five of them. You're outnumbered. This is how a man does. It. Well, pretty cool. How the fuck are you motherfuckers? Really? So impressed. I'm upset and impressed. What's happening? There's an emote on Jads called Joms that you're seeing in the red fucking Clifford dog in chat right now that they've wanted to have on Twitch for a long time. And now there's a Twitch emote of it because someone else added it to another streamer, I think I know who, added it to their emote list. And I guess a bunch of people went and got sub there and now they're spamming it here. Well done. Well done. <sighs> Copyright strike the email. I can't. I don't own Joms. Top Lolly owns Joms, and Top Lolly is probably cackling like a lolly right now. No good on this one. Oh shit.
I gave much of course what How many subs went into this? God damn. Weak to win in physical, right? So physical, we can get another one. You don't even have to sub to unlock the emote. It costs really cheap. Oh, with channel points and that? Oh, that's lame. I thought someone was making out like a bandit with this. As they should. It's a good play. You gotta respect it. You gotta respect it. I have it too. Dare, dare I Joms by own chat? Hold on. Dare I? Is it there? I have it too? Oh, it's there. D dare I Joms? Will it go down in screen cap history? I have joms. I've seen the light. Senpai, you're low on health. Be careful. Oh, yours. Do 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 do. I couldn't defeat it. You can win this. Just don't use dark. Senpai, you're low on health. Be careful. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that from you, Kanji. Do, 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 do. Cause this ain't a game. What's its problem? What are you, E2? The darkness. Come on, this fight's not over. You're not weak to darkness, though. Nah, it doesn't matter. Wait, this is well, Einstein's gate. Oh, I got some sad news for you. Or happy news. Do, 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 do. Mostly happy news. Change one to Arcana. Let's just deal new cards. Let's see what we get. New cards. Aw, oh, new Hachiman. Alright, uh, let's get a new Arcana. And up. Uh, I'd rather have an N up than a Hachiman. And up. Thank you, uh, Jaka Fogatseria. <laughs> Sorry. Thank you, Jaka, for gifting us sub to Titan Band 97. Thank you very much. Thank you, One Kasu, Kesu, for the 313 sub. Thank you, Chipped Chap, for the 6 month resub. Thank you very much. Thank you, Sabriel, for the 3 month resub. Thank you, Holy Moly Senior Podoli, for the 42 month resub. How is the Jom spam still going on? Thank you very much, Holy Moly Senior Podoli. Thank you, Zorgrox, for the 200 bits. And thank you, Squeaky Samurai, for the 12 month resub. Welcome to the one year club, Squeaky Samurai. Welcome, welcome. Damn, to think that, you know, like, if this was one day late, there would be no Joms until we were back from break. Damn. Damn. Thank you, Chaotic Despair, as well. Uh, very fitting for what's going on right now. Thank you very much for the for the three month resub, Chaotic Despair. Despair. Three of them. Don't give up now, okay? 
Everybody for 13 Sentinels where Joe misses spot points and argues with chat for the whole way through. Yeah, it sounds like a good time. This sounds like it was written by someone who doesn't understand that it's a plot on Persona 5. Remember that talk? Wow, now so Darkness. Beat it to a pulp. How about it? Limbs, you know, I'm impressed that there's a limbs. Let's have that talk again. Nah, it'd be spoilers for people who haven't played it. Weebs are plot hole blind, I think. And honestly, more power to them. Story consistency is overrated, it's about themes. Go yeah, some people do do think that, and again, more power to them, you know? You can count on me. There's that whole video that a lot of people agree with about, um, please shut up about plot holes or whatever. Um, I think that video is pretty shit, but uh, a lot of people agree with that, and okay, more power to them if that's what they like in stories, but yeah. We don't need the skill level up, right? Yeah, let's go. It's gonna sound really condescending and I really don't mean it that way. Um, because if anything, I'm a little envious. Uh, it's, if you if you care more about that sort of thing, instead of like, oh, the, the Reaper's here. Instead of how like stories are constructed and put together and everything. Oh, there's no chest to open it though. Um, it, it's all, it's like stories have retained their, their sense of like childlike wonder to you. And I mean that in a good way. I know it sounds condescending. Oh, you, you enjoy media like a child. That's not what I mean. It's, it's like the, like returning to that sense that you have where it's like, oh, like there's this air of mystery to how plots are constructed to you, that sort of thing. Chuckle, I can't believe that you came without cowering uh, in fear. Is that bravery or ignorance? That's how I appreciate music. Like, so like I, I have that too. Very well, I'll be waiting for you at the end of the Yomatsu Hirosaka. Was that Izanami? Let's not freak out, come on senpai. Is that your no? Because like I do the same thing with music. Careful. It used to be that way with cinematography too in um, in movies, and now not really. I, I see it more now. I'm not sure if it's a good thing. Uh, let's just do a hama. Fuck it. Nice. senpai. You really get me going. Anyone weak to darkness? Repel. No. Three of them. Don't give up now, okay? Someone finish this one off. You can win this. You're weak to physical, so we can just snipe you down. Chat, I have no problems at all uh, condescending my audience, as you all know. So, like, when I say I don't mean this in a condescending way, I'm actually being honest, because I have no fucking issues going there. Okay, like. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, I guess Masukanda? Eh, just guard. Senpai, you're low on. Just. Okay, we can kill you. Who's next? Oh, we're next. Um. Let's do burning petals. Oh, with the petals. So persistent. Ooh. It's weak. Senpai, you're low on health. Be careful. You can't reflect uh, Megalovania, right? Mary's Mary, Mary Steam or Rose in, Rose in the Desert? Um, 
probably Sim River Simba Desert, but it's surprisingly close. There's something about Marie's theme that makes me think of like um, old Final Fantasy games and Chrono Trigger, and I really like those soundtracks. So uh, it really, really speaks to me. So I like it quite a lot. Tenacious. Why is this thing just the destroyer of worlds? <laughs> it ain't going down. All right, surely, surely she won't miss. Surely she won't miss. Okay, good. LLU, it's gotta be capped by now, right? Oh well, never mind. Oh, two of the same. Thank you, Arknox, for the six month resub. Thank you very much. Here is my very sincere thing. Oh, wow, look at its stats. I didn't think we'd actually get to 99 in all of them, but we are. Holy shit, look at that. 99969797999. God damn. Thank you very much, Arknox. Careful, set. It's an Arknox life. Oh, he didn't heal! Oh, shit! Physical. Senpai, you're low on- Uh, Hama. That's great, Senpai! I'll you're use really my Mahama. Nice. Just the result I expected. Last dungeon. Well, maybe. And still using our medicine. Chewing soul. Hmm. This'll be fine. You're on a right, roll, keep going. Two defeated. Wow. <laughs> Holy Just crap. Two left. Come on, this fight's not over. Someone finish this one off. Wait, what the fuck are you weak to? Oh, lightning. And what the fuck are you weak to? You can win this. You but drain not by lightning. Using ice. Um I wasn't expecting that from you, Kanji. Sweet. It's over. <laughs> Enemy down. Ready? Set. It's showtime. Are you ready? Ready when you are. Yeah. Go, go, go. Damn, fusing OC tune sure was a good idea to make sure you could handle the late game. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. We need an edge, don't we? Oh, did I level up? Ma, ma, N, and Adj. We need one Adj, two Ns, and three Ma's. All right, let's see if I can remember that. One of these days you, you will use Man's Way. I feel it. I already did use it. We used it on a group earlier. And we were all pretty fucking whelmed. It missed most of its targets, so it was kind of like a, like, meh. Oh, fuck. God damn it. Yeah, let's go back. If you equip that plus five armor, it'll be a 99 OC. A fake 99 OC, boosted by armor. We can take the paper R band off now, actually, can't we? 
but Nanako made it. What else did Nanako make for us? A ring from Nanako increases evasion against magic. Okay, there we go. We, we put something else on that Nanako made. Is our persona still 9-9? Still <gasps> oh no! Oh no, it's not. We still need more. All right. We need 8 Ma, 7 N, and 6 Edge. All right. I feel a Yukiko 1F coming on. Anything we can hit you with? Probably not. Stop the gorilla. I couldn't defeat it. Turn to Scarlet. Oh yeah, we're finishing today, even if it's tomorrow when we finish. Flowers wafts. Yukiko, best party member. Did that do it? She heals, she attacks. Stylish. She's red, the color of Persona. No, that's not the way. This is the way. This is the fake way, and that way is the real way. This is the optional route. My gamer senses are never wrong. Do 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 do. You're on a roll, Senpai. Two defeated. Let's go. <gasps> Just it's weak to. Couldn't do it. It ain't going down. Oh, senpai, that was so cool. Enemy defeated. You're off to a good start. My God, it's mod spam. Who mods the mods? Elimination complete. Me oh yeah, that's right. It's <laughs> Sigma Drive. Watches the watchman. Uh oh, that one's immune to darkness. You're on a roll, I senpai. Two senpai. defeated. <laughs> You're Open doing well. Guys, hang in there. What? Well done, everyone. I'm telling you, these insta kills are the way to play. Congrats, senpai. Oh, we can get a hello now. Nice. Hello. Is it me you're looking for? Do you see how the, the thing doesn't sit properly on the mini map? It kind of moves around a little bit, the icon for the stairs. Kind of messing with me a bit. Mm-hmm, so you have come to realize the scenery of this corridor. You've seen it before, haven't you? Yes, I remember. What you saw in your dream that night was the result of your awakening to your power. Could it be the fate? Could it be fate that I now await your arrival? Chuckle. Was that Izanami again? Senpai, is it true what she just said? Anyways, no matter what kind of enemy we're facing, we have to fight. Right, Senpai? No. Alright, we still have some Persona slots. Dude, 
Be careful. There's an enemy immune to light. Three enemies. You're doing well. Yeah, shuffle time. Man, a watermelon. So as as we are approaching the end of the game, this time for sure. What was what was everyone's favorite moment? Man, a watermelon. Great vegetables collapse. Another level! Gotta keep at it! Me liking where you say, aww, only humans have human rights? Looks like that You can win. Please! Here goes! Enemy down. Great work, Yukiko Senpai. Let's go. Well, now, Tokun, you never lose your cool. The woo? None shall escape. Is he doing a video on the Persona games? Nah, I've already made that fan base cry enough. No video. Careful! That enemy's immune to wind. And stay at it. You're off to a good start. All right. Senpai, you really get me going. This is going well. This is how a man does it. Three of them. Don't give up now, okay? Get a crit. So persistent. God damn it. Get a Mahama. One at a time, we will Muhammad them down. Muhammad early and Muhammad often. Thank God. Elimination complete. What Persona game am I streaming next? Probably Royal. Three Unless Persona 3 gets a, a remaster. But the next stream game after this is 13 Sentinels, but it won't be for a while. I'm, I'm on break after this. Be careful, Senpai. Send something up ahead of you. Open the door and enter. Fuck yeah. Here we go. The power that you have attained and your determination to face me. Let's see how strong they are. Oh, that's not good. Darkness won't. You can win this. Just Rampage. All right. Let's take them down in one hit. Last one. Go for it. An act of self-defense. Man, an all out attack. And action. Now we're talking. Go, knock them out. Oh, it's 
quite tenacious. Going in now, Toe. Very well. <laughs> Serves him right. I couldn't do it. Good move, Naoto Kun. You're on a roll. Knocked them right off their feet. Shot it in the butt. So it wasn't that was enough to break your will. Come then, though you may accomplish nothing, but then to needlessly prolong your suffering. All right. Don't really understand what's happening right now. I finished having sex, what did I miss? Nothing really big happened in the last five seconds, don't worry. Oh, be careful. Light's no good on this one. Senpai, you're low on health. Be careful. Two remaining! It. You guys weak to fire? Senpai. No. It's weak to ice. This will be light won't work. Two no. enemies left. Don't lower your guard now. Why is it funny? Why is it, why is it just nothing we No <laughs> Alright, is anyone weak to physical? No, I think we just do Yeah, let's do that then. And Madoon? Yeah, Madoon for sure. Madoon early. Yeah! Well done, everyone. Is it raining? No. Okay. Shit. Remember when we were getting oh, shuffle careful. times all over the place? No good on this one. Wait, do you reflect it or Darkness No you don't. Okay, we're good then, Muhammad. Let me concentrate. Thank you, bedazzling dazzler, for the nine month resub. I meant to say that a while ago. I saw it come in and then I guess I was in the middle of a fight. Sorry about that. Thank you much, bedazzling dazzler. Super dazzling. Ugh, it's quite tenacious. You can four of them. You need to thin them out. <laughs> Damn, couldn't finish it. Go with the pedals. Yukiko Senpai, two defeated so far. Good move, Nato-kun. You're on a roll. Serves him. 
Where's our shuffle time? Give me a shuffle. Am I not? Is it because I'm not getting enough weaknesses at the end? Pro oh my god. Oh my god. All right, what are you weak to? Three of them. Don't give up now, okay? Yay, a shuffle time! Man, a shuffle. Alright, here we go. Four more. Hmm. Four more, and then new cards. I'm risking it for a biscuit. Lose an earn card. Half money. Alright, half money. And then we lose that card. Yeah, and then we change to a brand new persona. Nice, this was good. The other, northwest has to be the way. It's looking good. What is sweeping gonna do? It, I think it guarantees that you get another shuffle time at the end of the battle. And as long as you keep a sweep going, you get shuffle times all the time. I think. Or it just increases the chances. It definitely does one of those two. Keep going! You're so cool, Senpai! That's great, Senpai! You really get me going! Beat it to a pulp! Keep going, guys! Isn't it the same music that plays when the bad things happen during the credits? Um, I think so, yeah. Four more! Damn, another shuffle. Metatron. Good footstep sound. Oh, be careful. Light's no good on this one. Man, this game should have ended 20 hours ago. You're on a roll, Senpai. Senpai. Too defeated. Fucking hell. Oh. Dark. Enemy dead. Nice town, move, Senpai. Senpai. Senpai, you're low on health. Be careful. Nice, Yukiko. Why don't you rush to the end? OC must be capped at 9 9. The meme must be done. Oh, half money and no money. Nice. Oh, this could be anything. Could even be no more money. I'll L you up. We don't need it, though. Fight Reaper. I will fight the Reaper if we have a chance. Take a chan, take a chan, take a take a chan. This is the end. This that's the end. This is this is the secret way. We go up here, get a chest, and then we go back down to the end. I have never been more right. Never been more right. <laughs> Be careful. There's an enemy in light. Uh oh. Oh, our health is kind of low. You're on a roll, Senpai. All right, keep going. Two defeated. Enemy down. Nice move, Senpai. Senpai. Someone finish this one off. Two enemies left. Don't lower your guard now. 
Whoa. It's my turn. It's showtime. Are you Man, ready? Man, a crit. Do this in style. Yeah, go, go, go. No way. Four more enemies are here. A woo? Electricity will... You can... Four enemies... Oh, they have Balzac. Who's next? All right, you're next. All right, I think we can do a safe Mahama. I want to get a heal, a uh, heal on Waffles. Enemy defeated. You're off to a good start. Who's next? Oh, they're next. There's no way they'll kill Waffles, right? There's no way. They're just gonna die right now anyway. Phew. Keep it up now, Two enemies. Down. Our moment has okay. A understood. Here goes. Do, 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 do. Man, we're never going to get nine nine. Shit. All right, no money. Half XP. Lose a card, what are we gonna lose? Uh, is it always the one directly next to it? Go, go, Hachiman. Thank you, Phoenix Furion, for gifting a sub to Jomunism. Nice. We did it. Wow, the healing at the end of a match because of Rise. Like, that's significant. And our SP is just basically capped the whole time because of that, too. Rusei so strong. Thank you very much, Jominism. Oh, sorry, Phoenix Jerem for gifting us up to Jominism. Returned, the Jom spam has. I'm a Twitch meme. So you made it safely thus far. Despair, emptiness, and hope. Those are the three qualities by which I selected those coming from outside. You showed the most grounding of the three. I expect nothing less. In which case, I will personally and directly test your power. The three qualities, did she mean Senpai, Namatame, and Adachi? Is it Nami saw those qualities in them? What kind of power does she have? Okay. Despair. Uh, oh, our personas are, are full. Nice, let's go fuse, because I want that new one. And if we have enough money, we will fuse um, one of the, one of the multi-fusion ones. Dee -dee. Do, 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 do. Can I leave? Hmm? Visit shops. Wait, I can visit shops and then come back in again? Wow. Breaking all the rules. All the rules are broken. All right, so we're not level 90 yet for that, but we can get a Hellel. Is there anything else we can get? Not even a cloth though, wow. All right, so let's get a Hellel. Um, hold on, first of all, let's see. What do we have for our other ones? We have a Belial and a Seth, and we have a Metatron. Oh, we can't get Lucifer yet anyway, so Belize Bub. All right, what about the Pentagon ones? No, Cross, no, and that's it. So we don't want to use Adavaka. And we don't want to use Belial or Seth. Adavaka, Belial, and Seth. Adavaka, Belial, Seth. Okay, that one's good. They all use Metatron. Let's go this one. Super hot. Super hot. Who dares summon me? You are a noble child. To bear such a strong light, I shall grant you the grace of God. I am Hillel. I will attempt to live up to the strength in your heart. The star social link is refuses Hillel with power. Oh, we have salvation now. 
insta heal. What's insta heal? It's an insta heal. It's not gonna do shit. Time needed to recover from ailments is reduced by one turn. Oh, that's pretty good. Repel wind. Hehe. <laughs> You have wings! How are you weak to wind? Arms Master. What does Arms Master do? How does she cost for physical skills? Oh, that's pretty good. Morning Star. Like Lucifer Morningstar? Ch allow Arms Master to change. Now nah, I'm good. Alright, so we need a Bel Belphegor, Bal, Zebu, Mott, and Pazuzu. Let's see if we can fuse any of these together. Belphegor. Belphegor. Mott, Pazuzu. It's not looking good. It's not looking good. Nope. All right, Odin's back. Tell a friend. Let's just skip this. If only there was a way. Wait, you can hold down triangle? Why didn't anyone tell me that? Alright, we want Kinky Suki Fuki Oni. Kinky Suki Fuki Oni. Su kinky Fuki Suki Oni. Pretty low down, aren't they? They're not high up ones. Kinky Suki Fuki and Oni. Oni was the low one, I think. Oni, there we go. Fusing is so much easier when you have an OC, you just don't have to care what you get. Just like, fuck it, just fuse it. I just want the compendium entry. Man, look at this guy. I am Ongioki. I'm one of many reciting in the Sea of Your Soul. Alright, do you like karaoke? Firm stance. Always take half damage, but you can never evade. Not worth. Not worth. Alright, Triglav, Kinky, Ares, Neko Shogun.
That is a lot of white riders. Holy shit. Is Belphegor on there? You would think that Belphegor would be on here right now, right? No? Belphegor. Belphegor. Oh, let's use a Michael. I think we need my. Oh, I want our OC! God damn it. Oh, they almost got me. They almost got me. Not without my OC. Doo, 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 doo. If it's OC, it's an OC. Exactly. spots do we have now we have one two three four five all right so we can get a uh whatever the fuck this is uh adavaca triglav kinky aries adavaca triglav kinky aries neko shogun all right i don't think i'm gonna do this I'm, i don't think i'm gonna do this one these two i think this is it I just want to do these ones, and that's it. I have no money. What do you mean I have no money? I have no money. Alright, we're done. Alright, cool. Alright, then you go find Yennefer. I'm starting to think the dream is dead for the uh, the max out OC. Oh, it's a little tank! Look at the little tank! Aww. Oh, a Ma and an N up. Oh, it's oh and a Persona up. My God, just when we thought we had lost all hope. I gained a level. Remember the start of this round when you said Yosuke was the best boy? That feels like you're go years ago. Yeah, he, he started so well. And then just... No. Two homophobics. So much. <laughs> do, 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 
Uh, of all the personas you played, what was the best social thing? All two of them? Um... Haru's and Hifumi's wasn't bad. Uh, I can't remember all of them from, um... From Persona 5 all that well. I can't even remember the ones in this in this game all that well anymore. Weak to, to light. Okay, we're good. Thank you, Lily Bell. Use case are being a bit, a bit dull. You know, like there were some really good ones, but I feel like a lot of these interactions came from other characters at the same time. You know, like not all of, not all of the social interactions with with Yosuke, with sorry, with, with Yusuke were bangers, right? Wait, what are you weak to? Ice. Yeah. Okay. Well, we don't have that. Oh well. Yusuke has the romantic boat ride and pose for me and, and stuff like that, and, th and that's good, but um, let's go no XP and then deal new cards and we should be able to get all of them. God damn it. God damn it. Yeah, it's always the most l latest one. Shit. But then you also have all those all those uh, scenes with you with Yusuke. I keep wanting to say Yosuke with Yusuke, where you're just hanging around the museum and shit, right? Or just hanging around the subway, just kind of like meh. Ons is a waste of time. Haru actually has a personality, so I, I liked Haru's interactions. Hifumi actually had a personality, but not as much as Haru, so I enjoyed Hifumi's. Uh, Makoto's was just like, remember Makoto's? It wasn't even about her; it was about her stupid fucking friend. Makoto's was fucking terrible. God, Makoto's was so bad. You know, like they could have done so much better with her character there, but no. Uh, Makoto's was awful. Ryuji's was just about the team, right? Like Ryuji's is like, man, all right, whatever. Um, the side characters in. Um, in Persona 5. Was the politicians alright? The politician was just like, I they did alright with how much they had to work for, which is like, it was always in the same area, right? I guess that was a little interesting. Be careful. Wow. On wasn't even the, the best girl on their social link. Yeah, that's true, yeah. You're so cool, I like you, Mika. Are you a waifu? The teacher, the teacher legitimately bamboozled me, so I have fond memories of the teacher. Not that I have that fantasy or anything, but you know, it's pretty good. Uh, bamboozle. And we got Becky Bucks out of it. Yeah, Becky Bucks, Doctor Legs. Dr. Legs was just good because of the legs, you know? That's just being horny on main. Dojima 2.0 that sells the guns uh, was alright, I guess? Like yeah, I, thinking about this makes me realize that most of the social links in these games just are, are really bad. Coffee Dad was okay, I like Coffee Dad. Go get him! Go, go, go! We have oh, our one! Places, everyone! And action! Ready when you are! Go! Beat him up! What are the, what's the worst one in, um, in Persona 5? It's either the arcade playing kid, the fortune teller, or the the journalist in the bar, right? It's got to be one of those three. Those have to be the worst ones. Kanji, you I think I prefer Kanji. 
If we're talking about meme ability, then, then you scale away. But as a character, I think I prefer Kanji. Journalist was actually pretty good. I, thought, I don't think we finished that one, so maybe it gets better. Be careful. There's an enemy immune to light. Fortune teller is cute at least. Yeah, very cute. Super cute. Favorite character from both games? Risei, of course. She's my wife, who I don't know. Maybe Kanji. I just like Kanji's like no nonsense attitude and and then he like moves between just being like irritated all the time and just being like so straightforward and then being very like like shy and wholesome and I and I like the the comparison between the two. Kanji's entertaining, but Yusuke is also like so far up there because of just how how entertaining he gets in, in, with the memes. To win. Which is weird because on, you know, considering my taste, should be the slam dunk favorite, but nope. Forgot she existed. Well done. You're so cool, senpai. Go for it, guys. Hang in there. Do 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 Yeah, she's literally Taylor Swift. Cannot believe you're still unperturbed even after stepping so far into my realm. One had not the eyes to see things as they were and failed to awaken his power. One chose to avert his eyes from the truth and allowed evil to taint his awakened power. But this one, he has come th this far. He still yearns for the truth. He still fights. Sounds like Izanami surprised by Senpai's power even though she's the one who awakened it. Could it be that Senpai's power went beyond her expectations? Damn. <laughs> So is Anami the one who also ran over uh, Dojima's wife, or is that going to be um, a different sort of thing? Or is that just going to be unresolved forever? <laughs> Five of them. Dojima You're might so be cool, might be the most fleshed out character in the series, like right? Who who gets more time and, and more like emotional depth than Dojima? Like you actually explain, you actually learn more about it. Like I, he's kind of an asshole character for like ignoring Nanako, but like Dojima is like maybe Sojiro, but Sojiro is just Dojima again, you know? Like. Well done, everyone. Low bar. Oh, for sure. Like, like in in most stories, Dojima probably wouldn't even rank, or would be like middling. Nice, but like in Persona 4 and 5, like pretty well flushed out character for all things considered. Akechi's quite flushed out too. Come to think of it, Akechi gets some gets some stuff, you know. immune to electricity. Daddy issues equals flesh time. I'm like, yes, honestly, my metric guys. right now is just screen time where yeah. they're not the talking about the power of friendship. Like, if you find the character that has the most screen time where they're not just be like, yeah, togetherness, yeah, I really, I think we can do it as long as you stick together. Like, if you, you could just like math it out, be okay, careful. whoever There's has the most screen time when they're not doing that shit is by default, you know, the most fleshed out character in the Five series. Left. Hang in there. Sai, I think Akechi yeah, gets more. Does he? Sai's alright, I like Sai. Is she romanceable in Royal? Please, steady. No, god damn it. Senpai. <laughs> Come on now. Enemy down. 
We it's can... my turn! Yeah! So persistent. Going in now, Tom. Very well. Get lost! Enemy defeated. Lose a dot card. All right, don't get rid of the deal new cards. Yeah. All right, what's the new card? Yeah. All right, we got a sweep going. New girl in Royal is is very fleshed out. I, I heard that she was uh, only interested in uh, one certain type of flesh, particularly. But I guess we'll see when we play it. What's your name, Katsumi? Does Makoto hate her? I hope so. Oh, that would be so good. You can three of them. Don't give up now, okay? Are you excited for a new story in Persona 5 Royal? I haven't played myself, but I have good friends who say it's a step up from the main game. In terms of writing, it's supposed to Persona 4 Golden One. Most people seem to dislike the added ad scenario. Yeah, I'm excited. I just, I, I really like the cast of uh, of Persona 5, so I just like would like to see them in more. Like, I'm excited for Strikers, even. Like, yeah, that's, that sounds like a good time. Like, I can see why people are defensive about about um, about uh, the games because they get attached to the characters even though they're not that fleshed out all that well um, The games still have quite a lot of heart and like the interactions that they have like not many games do this do this like friendship simulator where um, There's like a, a gang that are hanging out together so I can see the appeal for sure and I, I like it too like um, So it's good to just see them do shit, you know like But um Persona 4 Golden might might have been a mistake for the pacing, but it's like if I had played it originally, Light won't work. Plan B, anyone? shit, uh, I, I might be like, yeah, I don't I give a shit. I already know what went on, so attack. all the extra stuff that I that I'm seeing as I go through, like I don't care. It's good it's good for me because I just want to see more of this char these characters, right? Why? Well, that's bad. Well, now, Tokun, you never lose your cool. Cool, Takeji Zaipin. Enemy down. Fantastic, Kanji Kun. Get a crit. Damn, couldn't finish it. Light won't work. Plan two and you. Turn to Scarlet. So persistent. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 Congrats, queer ass. Congrats. Someone finish this one off. It got back up. Defeated fast. Good move, now, Tokun. You're on a roll. Oh no, I want lightning. Shit. Uh, get a crit. No. Expecting that from you, Kanji. Sweet. Go for it, guys. Hang in there. <laughs> it 
Has anything been spoiled for me, Persona 5 Royal? Well, I know there's a new character, but that was in the trailer. And I know that, that, um, well, this is a spoiler for someone who might not know about it, so I won't say it, but I know something about Morgana, but I'm not sure if that was just misdirection or if it actually happens or not. Get lost! Do I know any spoiler for Persona 3? Nope. I don't know anything about Persona 3 whatsoever, um, apart from the characters hold their guns to their head to summon their personas. That's three, right? I want the Ag, but we might get an Ag and a, and a Ma with deal new cards. Let's try it. No! No! What's that? Do we have that one? Balzebu. Owned. I'm not owned. Take it you're not playing uh, Royal after Persona 4? Not right away, no. I think story wise, Persona 3 is probably the best one. That's what people said about 4 when we were playing 5. Now then, Nato then. Can't stop me. Senpai, you're low on health. Be careful. Three enemies. Hang in there, Naoto Kun. You did it, Naoto Kun. Enemy defeated. Don't stop now, Naoto Kun. Thank you, Gearfrax, for the 513 sub. Sorry it took me so long to see it. Thank you, Gearfrax. Thank you, Integrity744, for the 16 month sub. Thank you, Richard Maziak, for the 12 month sub. Welcome to the One Year Club, Richard Maziak. And thank you, Taco Waveable, for the 36 month sub. Three months, uh, sorry, three years of putting tacos in the microwave. Thank you very much. For, uh, welcome to the three year, three year club. Taco Waveable. Yeah, that one will. My own question, why do you think Terraria and games like it are rarely talked about by game journalists for viewers? Like Terraria is widely popular, but I've only seen two, like, two videos analyzing it from a design perspective. Because people don't know how to talk about game design when it comes to just gameplay. Like they, There's no real like story and themes to dig into in, in Terraria. And the experience is... is uh, Looks like that one's immune to wind. Like, you, you rarely see it about Minecraft either, you know? Like, or at least I think so. It's, it's hard to talk about that shit. I would love to do a video on Terraria. I think Terraria is very well designed. You're doing well. Did you put the slutty outfit on Nato yet? No! Oh. 
from the outside too, Terraria kind of looks like um, just like a like a casual waste of time, you know. Like I really like Terraria, but I can see people just dismissing it as like, ah, eh, whatever, you know. Why, why do you oppose me? I did not choose three pawns in jest. It was all to ascertain what mankind wished for. I learned that man gladly favors falsehood over truth. Thus, I sought to fulfill their desires by shrouding the world in fog. True, there's a lot of things we don't see, and yeah, some of them we prefer not to, but that doesn't mean that everyone wants to live blindly, as an army has it all wrong. We've got to end this. Isn't that all games? I don't know. Nah, I mean, like, if you're into games, like, it's specifically about game journalists, right? So, like, if you're a game journalist, presumably, um, there's at least some of them that respect games and think that, they, that they're that they worthy of, you know, discussion and study. Uh, so, once you've already bought into that, you know, there's, there's a range of ones that look appealing to you like that or not. No, no. Weak to lightning. Hmm. Wow. Any chance you'll touch Persona 2? If it comes out on Steam, if there's like a remaster, I'll do it. If I have to set up like a PlayStation to do it, like, uh, unlikely. What the fuck? You can win this. The scent of flowers walk. Thoughts on emulation? Like, in terms of morals, uh, there's there's definitely ways that you can, like, ethically emulate games. Like, if you already own the physical copy, or if you can't legally obtain it anymore, or, like, the only copies are, like, second-hand use copies, then, you know, that's fine. Um, but in terms of legality, you know, like... Sure, Twitch doesn't seem to care right now, but as we saw in the past, it's not always like that. Things could change very, very quickly. So I'd rather not, you know, now, risk okay? my livelihood just to play, um, Turn to Scarlet. Persona 2, you know? What was it the game? You know, I'm gonna get banned for, for uh, streaming Ghost it. Trick or something, you know? Like, Ghost Trick looks like a good time to me, but, yeah. No, it was Luigi's Mansion or something like that. It was like, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking risk everything just to play Luigi's fucking mansion on stream. Yeah, okay, <laughs> that was it. It was Luigi's Mansion. Natsukun's busting heads and looking cool. What's its problem? More incoming. Come on now. You leave this. Here it goes then. <laughs> I'm ready to understood. It's showtime. Are you ready? Yes, let's finish them. Go! Knock them out! Wow. Wow. Ninety four, ninety eight, ninety six. Fearing games, what's important? Gameplay or story? Uh, like, there's always gonna be exceptions, but usually gameplay for sure. Ninety four, ninety eight, ninety six. Okay, so we need one N, five Ma, and three Ad. Uh, Alright, we might get there. I'm very interested in games that can make a story that's unique to the medium and uses the medium strengths, but that's very hard to do and not many have done it. And, um, you know, I still, f I feel like we still haven't figured out gameplay all that well yet, so. I like gameplay. Would you say the near games effectively use the medium color stories? Well, I've only played Automata, and I don't 
really remember there being anything in Tomata that needed to be a game. Like, maybe a couple of little moments here or there, or like little bits and pieces, None but like a lot of games have little moments here and there. Like, yeah, this really works because it's a game, but um, like the whole larger story, you know, like I, I can't really remember anything in Automata that couldn't have been uh, uh, communicate, communicated almost as effectively um, or virtually as effectively uh, in like a movie or an anime or something like that. Like, I, I can't really remember. Did Disco Elysium do a good job, or would Disco Elysium be better as a book? Uh, Disco Elysium is like a very complicated choose-your-own-adventure story, uh, and you can wander around and take it in. Um, I think it did a, did a really good job, but Disco Elysium's strength is just, it just has probably the best writing of any game. So it just wins a lot of points just, just by having such strong writing. My guess is that Disco, Le Disco Elysium's writer um, had a lot of power and a lot of sway over the project and a lot of things were changed uh, because of the writing to, to facilitate the writing or there was just an, an absurd amount of planning that went into that. But even with a lot of planning, as, as things come together and you finalize a lot of things, um, you'll find that you'll want to change things because you, cause you make connections between how things can present itself. Like I'm sure there was there were many points during Disco Disco Elysium's production that um, after things were getting closer to like a more solid draft, like not just a rough draft, not like gray boxing shit out, that um, that they were like, oh, this visual can inform this part of the writing, or we can have this scene now that I can see the visual of, of how this is gonna work, and this animation gives me an idea of how we can do that, and I, and I bet you a lot of things change because of that. This feeling, there's something past here again. Be careful, senpai. Open the door and enter. Yes. All of this has been chosen by mankind, and whatever strength you possess is still within man's scope. You cannot surpass me. Learn that. Uh oh, that one's immune to darkness. You can win the last. One. You can win. You can win. Light won't work. You can win this. Just Sounds like she was saying you can win this with a different voice line. I wonder if they did like slightly tweaked ones. All right, um, power charge. probably answered this before, but how strict do you plan on being with the games that won the voting game? Is there any hope of seeing a game that lost the vote be played before this is done? Uh, it's possible. Like, I don't remember all the games that lost the vote, because there was just so fucking many of them, so, like, it's possible that between the voted games I might take a break and play a game that I've wanted to play for a while that's short, and it just so happened to have been on the, um, on the voting list and lost, you know? So, yeah. But for the most part, I'll be sticking with the list until the list is done. Here's how Uminako has so I'm I am never streaming Uminako. It's too long. Who'd want our world to be covered in fog? We sure don't. And I know Nanako Chan and Ojima san would agree. We're not gonna let her do whatever she wants, right, Senpai? Right. This feels really superfluous and like it doesn't matter at all. Like I I I'm really don't give a shit about what's going on. I feel like this should be like the big like, oh my god, there was something going on behind the scenes all along. Maybe it's because the, the, the Marie kind of thing that happened with Golden kind of took that. But I just, it's like, okay, whatever, you know? Like, do, 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 do. 
Oh, that's not good. Darkness won't work. Shouldn't be a dungeon either, just straight to the boss. Yeah, that would be interesting. Maybe, again, maybe it's because of golden. Wait, what are you weak to? Ice, right? It's ice. It's weak to wind. This will be a breeze. One enemy to go. <laughs> Keep it up. Beat it to a pulp. Keep going, guys. Let's go. Enemy down. Precisely. Marie legit ruined Golden. I'm not sure. I like I like what happened with Marie and the snowboarding thing and everything. I feel like that should have been an ending. Maybe think of ways that the that the structure could be used where it's like a group of people traveling from place to place and getting into some getting into some trouble and then the TV like deciding, hey look, you need to help this place. This is the problem it has here. And you can like move to like new and exciting situations instead of being stuck in the same place constantly. You know, not that there's all that much wrong with being in that place all the time, but um, it got a little tiring, I think. Change one to Arcana. Uh, it's not going to change the level up, right? There's no way. Yeah, alright. Nine, six, nine, eight, nine, nine. Alright, there we go. Let's see if there's a goal. Heard Simulator is great writing on MIO, MIO and the gameplay fits the story well, even though it's frustrating. Yeah, I've heard of it. Um, it's come up in some of my in my lists, research lists of when I'm like looking into video game budgets and everything for my game dev plans. And um, it looks all right. Looks kind of looks kind of dull to me, but maybe a fun time. Uh, wasn't, wasn't there like some controversy with someone in that though? I guess that doesn't matter about the game. Hades? What about Hades? Have I played it? Yeah, I've played Hades. We even streamed it. It's alright. I don't love it as much as everyone else though, sorry. Like, it's fine. But it's like, Hades is, is, um, is better than Isaac. Like, but it has the same problem that Isaac has is that whenever I'm playing it, I just think, I'd rather just be playing Gungeon. I feel like Hades doesn't have enough enemy variety and, um, uh, whatchamacallit, um, boss variety, boss variety for sure. And some of the enemy variety in Hades is kind of frustrating. My skills have been honed. It's a good game, for sure, but, uh, it's not, like, fantastic, oh my god, game of the year for me. Gungeon gameplay loop sucks. Damn. My rule right now is that I don't really read usernames. That's how I have chat interaction back, is I don't really read usernames anymore. But I know who said that even without reading the username. Do 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 we wanna go get the chest now? Fuck it, let's just keep going. How foolish, even if you learn of the truth, people will not find joy. What is best for mankind is to return to, to return the world to the void of its origin, where they need not shy away from the truth. This world is imperfect. All that exists will be thick fog and writhing shadows, a tranquility called peace that will last forever. Everything has been wished for and chosen by mankind who shall buy their decision. <sighs> thick fog and writhing shadows, so it comes down to her screwing up the world. You have no idea what we're about to face. We have to stop whatever it is that Izami has in mind. Man, I, I, I really think that as as a collective, like, our society, like, and I mean, like, the global society, not just, like, um, like, the society that I live in. Like, we really need to move past this whole thing. The world is complex. Uh -oh. I really wish that we could sweep it, sweep it clean so it was more simple to understand. Like, I get the appeal. I really do. Now, okay? But, like, I'm so fucking tired of it. Like, it's so overdone at this point. Have a better fucking, like... Oh, Chili! Oh, hey, how's it going? Oh, it's just dead. All right, cool. Have better motivations. Like, have have a more interesting reason for the things that you're doing. Oh. 
This was done in 2008. Yeah, and we're still doing it now. No. Like. say. The biggest, like, is it the biggest going, franchise right now? The the hard. biggest story, or the or like the the most like consumed story in all of history right now is fucking Avengers. As sad as that is, you know, like, like Thanos is just doesn't make sense. How, how, like, how is no one bothered by it? Does it make sense? It's just like, yeah, I guess we'll just go along with it. Like, it doesn't make any sense whatsoever. What are you doing, Thanos? Like, how do we take this seriously? Enemy down. Man, Marvel just can't do villains. Light won't work. I couldn't defeat it. He's literally called the Mad Titan, but he's not presented as being mad. He's not presented as being this insane force. He's presented as being quite stoic and reasonable, actually. And oh, look, look at his, look at his great character arc that he went through. And he's the victorious, like blah 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 blah. blah. You know, just I don't know. It's weak to wind. This will be a breeze. Um. Yeah, I guess we'll just do fire and hope we get a hit on the guy. This guy's evasion kind of fucks with me a bit. Don't tell me it's not working. You're saying that people need to be calculating evil that have mental issues. Well, yeah, that's exactly what I'm saying. Yep, yep. Thank, thank you for saying that. Yeah, that's exactly what I was saying. You're on a roll, senpai. Two defeated. I was trying to get lightning to get a, a shuffle problem? fucking reckoning what? dice. Wow. Senpai, you're low on health. Be careful. <laughs> Lay down and die already! Just two left. Fucking evade Come elk, on, man. this fight's not over. Well. Fucking evade elk. Yukiko Senpai? What are you weak to, dice? Wow, it's no. Wow, it's no. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Oh, thank you, Risei. I was lucky. <gasps> All we need now is Ma! One Ma and we're done! Wait, what level is OC? OC itself is level 90. We just need 99 more, I'm sorry, nine more level ups. That's that's doable. That's within the realm of possibility if we got lucky with our shuffle time. Uh-oh. Uh, you are weak to lightning and you are weak to nothing. No, three enemies left. You can win this. I couldn't defeat it! <laughs> Two enemies dead. Leave this here goes then. Hands are in the Dachi dungeon only now. Yeah, that's, that's a good point. Where are the hands? I couldn't go now, it. Let's see some more. Turn to Scarlet! Where is Jaw? Do the zoomers know where is Jaw, or is that just like an ancient meme now that no one would get when I say it? You really get me going. Just the result. Oh, did I level up? It's pretty ancient. It is pretty ancient, yeah.
Wow. People don't know Chappelle. Wow. Some of us are not Yanks. I'm not a Yank either. Sorry for not having an Anglosphere raising. Well, as long as you're sorry about it. Wow, now to keep it up, now to Kun. I should move ice, well. Ice, ice, baby. I couldn't defeat it. <laughs> it ain't going down. Two enemies left. Don't lower your guard now. What's your opinion on fighting shadows versus personas in dungeons in terms of mechanics or theme? What's your recruitment do you prefer cards in negotiation? I prefer the, the cards for sure. Um, but it seems like kind of a waste to have monsters in here instead of just using the personas. Like the personas look cool and they could have doubled up there, which is probably what they did. Oh Ma! Man, a Ma! So some of the shadows look really cool looking, um, but like I think I'll probably mix it, I think, and then just do with the cards. Shuffle time is way better than negotiations. All right, I think that's it, right? We're done? God damn it, fucking Reaper. All right, um, I think we're done. Yeah, a maxed OC. Not level 99 though, but that doesn't matter, does it? It's just the stats that matter. A maxed OC. Did you hear the welcome to this guy died a few days ago? Yeah, I did. It's really sad. He's really young. Ugh, it's quite tenacious. Just two left. Come on, this fight's not over. I can't defeat it. Come, Takeji Zaiten. Is everyone ready? Get set. Now we're talking. Go! Beat him up! Come on, persona level up. Persona level up. Persona level up. Nope. Can we see OC take on the Reaper and battle? If, if the Reaper, if we have a chance to fight the Reaper, I'll fight the Reaper. I'll even risk the 99 ma, ma on OC for it. All right, senpai. Uh oh, that one's immune to darkness. <laughs> On a roll, Stay it. This one's a gimme. Beat it to a pup. Keep going, guys. What? Someone finish this one off. That's a lot of health. Enemy down. Let's oh, what? It's showtime. Are you ready? You can count on me. Go. Knock them out. Are you just grinding for fun so Persona 4 never ends? I don't consider what I'm doing right now grinding. It's just like just clearing clearing floors as we go out for treasure chests and shit. Strength up, lose earn card. Um oh well. Doesn't matter anymore, does it? Let's just get some XP. A 
Another level. Gotta keep at it. Like, what if there's like good armor or a good weapon in one of these? You'll resist to the end, won't you? Then I shall fight with for the good of mankind with all my strength. You are but a few pitted against the wishes of many. Your strength is truly astonishing, but you are the exceptions. You will soon reach the place where I am. Now, come. Like she just said, I'm sensing a strong reaction from just ahead. This really is the last battle. Keep your guard up, senpai. Not on this floor. Uh-oh. That one's immune to darkness. Alright, keep going! Oh. <laughs> Just... You can win this. Good, Naoto-kun! Good! Keep Good job, Naoto! Get a crit! <laughs> I couldn't oh, defeat it! <laughs> Enemy Just Have at it! I live for this part! The scent of flowers walk. Why'd I do that? I should've just did a normal fire on the tank. No! It's not working? Yeah, I know. Yay! Go get him! Go, go, go! None shall escape! Oh, we got a weapon! Nice! Who's it for? Wow! Critical rate up low! That's a good upgrade, isn't it? Yeah, this was worth it. Nice. Sometimes worth. the gas mask do oh we're done all right cool all right well I don't think we're getting a level 99 OC but all the stats are capped so that's fine we're finally here are you ready proceed yes Congratulations in making it this far. Well, thank you very much, Ms. Root of All Evil. You granted certain individuals the power to enter the TVs. You created the Midnight Channel as well. Oh, for fuck's sake, Naoto. And lastly, yep. you started a rumor about the Midnight Channel to raise its public awareness. Uh -huh. Is this correct? All save one point. This midnight channel you speak of, it is indeed a device to draw hearts into this world. But it was always your individual wills that would determine what appeared on it. Humans ache to expose their suppressed sides, while the prying eyes around them are curious to see them lay bare. Doesn't that contradict what the eye said? 
the want to show, and the want to see. I granted a window that catered to both. That is all. Everyone wished to know more about the people who became famous through the media. And the Midnight Channel was there to grant their wishes. Once the person they wanted to see entered the realm formed by human thought, they would appear even more clearly. I see. So that's how it worked. Mm -hmm. Are you saying all you did was give that initial spark to Senpai and the others, then watched things unfold? And the rumors spreading, things going wrong. We're to blame for all that's happened? People's curiosity was at fault? Everything was for your sake. To create the world mankind so wanted. Man struggles to understand one another. You can only truly know a finite number of people within your lifetime. Yeah, of course. And? But humans disregard this fact and try to know more people than is possible. Mm, no. Only by comparing yourself to others can you define yourselves. Thus, your ever-present anxiety. Your anxiety causes you to see only what you want to see, and believe only what you wish to believe. As I said, your desire is for a world enshrouded in fog. Don't put words in our mouth. Got I must agree that the vast majority of people are exactly as you say. But we don't intend to live that way. <laughs> if we were fine with the world you're making, we'd never have come this far, damn it. <laughs> we'll keep searching for truth and figuring out who we are as we go on with our lives. <sighs> we all will. Together. Imagine being a god and having a bunch of anime power of friendship togetherness children show up and give you a lecture. Like, god damn it. No, no wonder the anime villains become the Joker. Like, holy fuck. That's right. No more butting into our business. Uh huh. We will continue to live in our world with everyone else. Aren't we only here because we push the issue? That's why. We'll decide our own fate. You'll see our potential. We'll put a stop to this. Alright, when are you gonna turn this into some mechanical flesh monster god? Angelic machine or devilish biology? What are you gonna be? Oh, looking like Angelic Machine! Oh, it's not! Well, kind of. What's underneath? Enjoy the music. Darkness no. This one's strong. Enjoy the music. I'm gonna go pee. Back in five minutes.
All right, here we go. Here we go. Time to do the exact same thing we've done on every single boss fight. Keep whatever buffs and debuffs we have available up and just fucking power charge and god hand. Yay, power charge. And if there's like a prompt, make sure you guard because it might be bad. Might be. Well, this is just phase one. Heal up just in case she doesn't use lightning again. Oh no! Anyway. Wish I had an AoE heat riser. Come, Kozeon. Oh, nice. houses, bud. Yeah, we saw the charge, okay. Is it worth it to do a uh, a lightning to use our magic charge up or nah, she must have done it. You cannot atone so easily for your foolish pride in stepping into the realm of the gods. Her voice sounds familiar. It's Nanako. Nanako. Nanako's VA isn't a kid. Oh damn. So she just went into the booth and pinched her nose. Respect.
Um, I think we can take a hit here. Let's do let's let's do burning petals. Careful, guys, you're really low on health. Persona! What's your problem? This is fine. <laughs> Tokun's hurt pretty bad. Can you heal What did she do? Yeah, whatever. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. All right. Do you think we can do it? Do you think we can burst her down? No re. Izanami seems impervious. What do you mean, Izanami seems impervious? What? What, what you mean? Mind charge. Oh. This one's okay. Let's go. I can do mind charge too. I guess we just stand here and let her RP for a bit. Okay, so either I have to do nothing, or I have to just, like, keep attacking down the health bar. I don't know. Let's do a round of guarding and doing nothing and see what happens. Maybe if we don't attack her for a turn, she's like, oh... You understand nothing, I see. Ignorant mortals. Seems like RP is the choice. Persona. 
Persona! At this rate, it will be impossible to defeat Izanami. You recall what Igor and Margaret told you. That is a crystal of power oh, God. which you have nurtured through your journey. An orb that repels fabrications of all sorts, dispels lies, and shines upon the truth. Truth is a thing which only appears to those who have observed, considered, and made a choice. At the end of the path you chose lies the truth. Believe in it. And continue without faltering. The orb, strength, the orb of sight begins to unmask Izanami's true form. Alright, is it a robot? Oh, 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 oh no, I'm back. Hey, how's it going? Well, then, allow me to show you my full splendor. Ah, uh, it's evil biology, okay. I am a god. Cool. I'll teach you the truth of your minuscule existences. Still would, to be honest. This battle will determine our future. A god? Huh! Bring it on! We've made it this far. We can't lose now! You cannot defeat me with strength alone. Soon, you will understand. Oh, we need magic. Look out! We've never seen anything like her. All right. That's a tough one. Darkness won't work. Why lightning specifically? Just like, fuck you, Kanji. Specifically, fuck you, Kanji. Like, just like, yeah. All right. Nice. Kind of want to do a shield of justice here, just in case. It's the first round. Yeah, let's do it. Nah, let's do Megalovania. We're fine. Wait. When does she get to attack? Yeah, let's do shield of justice. Thank you, Mada Madame Ghost. Nice for the 213 sub. Thank you very much. Madame Ghost. Primal Force, Primal Force, Primal Force, Primal Force. <laughs> Come on down. Nice. Fuck you, Kanji. No. Oh no! Good thing we have that shield. Damn. Uh, let's heat riser waffles. I too can use Masukunda. Zeodyne, Bazinga, Fury Asugami. I don't know what that does. Oh, it does nothing. Okay, cool. Do 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 do. Okay, so a mind charge plus another move together could wipe us. So whenever she does mind charge, I should use Shield of Justice. Alright, shield of justice. We should be able to, to eat two attacks in a row if there's no charge power up on it. Our defense is down right now though, but eh, we should be fine. We'll see. Eh, we'll see. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
Oh, 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 this isn't good. We should we have a magic charge right now, don't we? We should use Megalovania to get rid of it. Let's do it. People give this OST flack, but it's kind of brilliant. I have seen nothing but praise for it the whole entire playthrough, really. I think it's pretty good too. I have not seen a single person say that the music in this game sucks. Pretty bad. Can you heal her? No. I want to use now. Let's um. That's my charge. Or heat riser on Kanji. Heat riser on Kanji. Heat riser on myself for the defense boost. Yeah, they'll never see it coming. All right, don't miss. Yay! The stage is already set for your demise. I'll end your lives here. Yeah, grow! Great vegetables. Yukiko Senpai, your agility is down. Do 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 um she just used like a defense down, right? She might if we do double attack right now, we might die. I'm thinking shield. I'm doing it. I'm busting out the shield. Yeah, baby is very upset, sorry. Yukiko Senpai, your agility is down. Did we do Masukunda recently? <laughs> Let's fucking do it again. No balls. I don't give a shit about your no balls. I don't give a shit about your bet. I just don't want to have to do it again. Wow, Kanji has so much health. All the music. Yukiko Senpai, your agility is down. I wake up. Senpai, your agility is down. <laughs> Come on down. Persona. There. Uh oh, that doesn't sound good. Oh. Protect me, Kozeon. What? Why does your single target do less damage on your AoE? Oh, it doesn't. Oh, okay, you just suck. All right. Kozion. All right, Risa just making plays. All right. Okay, even if both hit, as long as she doesn't crit, can she crit? If she crits, we can die for sure. Like, as long as we're full HP, are we invincible? Without a defense down, that is. Or a mind charge. I kind of feel like we're invincible if there's no debuff or buff on her. Shouldn't 
someone heal Yukiko Senpai? <laughs> nope. How can OC be so good when he doesn't have attack of eight flapping arms that everyone loves so much? Oh, 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 fuck you, Yukiko specifically. All right. Oh, all right. Yukiko Senpai, your agility is down. All yours. We don't even need to... Damn. Alright. We don't even need to heal this turn. Doesn't bode well. Yeah, Rise! Give us the attack boost buff thing. Oh, okay. Uh-oh. Imagine a god hitting you and you dodge it and then you say it, you call it pathetic. Alright, the second to four times we'll be hearing this music swell. Uh oh, time for her to get serious. Galg of whatever eyes. Galgado eyes. What does that do? Oh, it does nothing. Alright, summons to Yami. What does that do? It does nothing. Alright, cool. Alright. Summons to your Yami. Alright. Oh, we get to do a fire attack with uh, Yukiko, or we could give Naoto some some uh, SP with a uh, soul. Ah, uh, I mean, we might want to use them later, right? No, oh, we only have 15 of them. It's really important. Ah. Oh. Uh oh. Oh. <laughs> but you can't buy ethers. <laughs> Do 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 All yours <laughs> Come on now do 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 we have a power charge? No. Heat riser on Kanji. That was worth it. Yeah, now that attack will last, buff will attack one turn more. 
All right, here we go. Third time hearing it. Yeah. Remember that time Persona 5 I beat the last boss with a level 2 starter Persona? That was fun. Chat was mad. Oh man, chat was mad. Yeah, I resummoned back the starter Arson, and I, I used- uh, that's the persona that killed the boss at the end. It took like four turns, I think. Oh no, ailment susceptibility and a mind charge! Oh no, we're we're definitely gonna have to use- wait, do, do you even do an ailment? Like, we're definitely gonna have to use a shield this turn. I can't lose here! Do, do, do. Persona, Persona, Persona. All right, use a soul food on yourself, Yukiko, because you're getting a bit low. Nice. World's end. LOL! <laughs> Summons to Yomi! Oh, okay. Summons to your Yomi! Alright. Uh, God Hand. Do, 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 do. At this rate, we actually are gonna hear that swell a fourth time. Fucking hell, Masukanda. Alright, let's top everyone off just in case. Kuru, what's that? Oh, it's the lightning one. Okay. Oh, we should have done Megalovania. Fuck. Okay, kind of feel like we should do a shield here. Nah, fuck it. We're good. Hope she doesn't do end of the world again. God, it would just suck to die right now after getting her this low. Goodbye. Accept the reality of your death. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Thousand curses. Kanji! No! Oh no! Kanji's fucking dead! Oh, Naoto's fucking dead. Don't give in. Please oh, no. Up. Oh, sh shit. Aren't, aren't you dead? Oh, no. Not you. Classmate, no. Study partner! Uh, Yukiko Senpai! No! It's unfortunate that our battle must end this way. Thousand curses. Alright, here comes Teddy. No? No, get up! 
We came so far. Oh, I guess we lose. Oh well. Imagine we went back to Velvet Room right now and the text all happened in Star Wars, like the Emperor's back somehow. No, okay, we're good. All right. Your team collapsed, your consciousness is fading. Is this where you will fall before a powerful enemy? No, you hear someone's voice. It's Adachi. What are you doing? Hey Margaret. Get up. You are not someone allowed to fall here. You must know already. The true nature of bonds. What bonds give to you. Like like bail bonds? Here. Listen closely. I thought you weren't allowed to interfere. What's the matter? Isn't it too early to give up? Oh god, it's Final Fantasy IV all over again. You taught me what a family truly is. I had my hands full just with Nanako when you came rolling in. <laughs> I wasn't sure what to do. But then again, I can get back up as many times as I need to with you two with me. However painful it gets, I'll just grit my teeth. I'll get up as many times as I have to for you two. My father can be pretty stupid that way, huh? Don't go, partner. Everything inside me changed after I met you. I'm glad we met. I wouldn't have made it this far if I hadn't done it alongside you. You can't let it end this way, right? You can keep going. Right, partner? No! Don't leave me! I'm scared. I'm such a stubborn, two-faced coward. But you understood me. That's why I can become as strong as I need to be. <sighs> hey, can you hear me? Don't close your eyes yet. I'll give you our strength. You're our last hope. Please, get back up just once more. You're dead, classmate. Oh, senpai, how much longer are you gonna just lie there? I mean, like that senpai? Not the kind of guy who can let it drop like this. Are all of them gonna show up? Is Lady Death gonna show up too? That ain't the senpai I look up to. Is there a cue? Get back up. Just one more time. Well, I can't wait for that to end, end. This is not where your story ends. Well, please get up. Get up. What? What? <laughs> Senpai, thanks. I'm glad I came to this town. When I think back on all the fun I had with you... Senpai, please stand up just one more time. Senpai, if you stay down, I won't forgive you. You gave me a reason for me to stay just as I am. Wait, what? Didn't we do the exact opposite of that? For someone like you to leave me in the dark halfway like this. Please stand up. Just once more. Let's fight this together. Never fear. We're always together. Does the doctor show? Oh my god, I hope so. You dumbass. <laughs> Let us worry about you for once. You don't have to shoulder the entire burden by yourself. We're right there with you. A couple of morons waiting to prop you up. Come on. You can stand, right? Oh, for fuck's sake. Everyone? Are you shitting me? I'm sorry I can't be there to support you in your hour of need. Life. It's filled with so many things that are dirty, grotesque, and painful. Okay, why did she say dirty like that? That that was not the right read of this line, voice actress. You sh like that like what? There's no way you can stand <laughs> alone. But no one is truly alone in this world. You know that. Since you've protected those precious to you. Right? Come on. People are waiting for you. I hope I hope the stock buying teacher shows up. By the dip, you moron. Come on, my dear. 
It's too early yet for you to sleep. I know you must be a little tired, but there are still people waiting for you. Have you really done everything you can for those precious to you? I feel like I'm being punished for maxing social social links here. Oh, for thanks, Mister. To tell the you. All right. <laughs> Man, you're so cruel. <laughs> you dumbass. You make me take responsibility for my sins, but you're gonna let this bitch take you down like this? <laughs> Is this meant to be uplifting right now? What? <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> Get up. You're not like me, right? Normally I would Sensei. normally I wouldn't root for you Waffles, but you're fighting a woman, so I'm on your side. Get up, dumbass. And just slap her. Like, what the fuck is this? I'll protect you, Sensei. You gave me my life. You're important to me. I'm not alone anymore. And neither are you, Sensei. I'm sure together we can do things that no one could do alone. Why are you still in the suit, bud? All right, who's next? Nanako. Was there anyone hey, else? Big bro. Hey, Nanako. Are you gonna leave me behind? After this, yes. We're going home. I'll be a good girl. So don't go. I don't want you to go. Aww. Big bro. Can you hear everyone's voices? The people do not wish for a world enveloped in fog. There are times when they'll stop and think they can't go another step. But everyone desperately pushes on. Please, grant everyone's wishes. Bring light to people's hearts. Please get up. Just once more. The hearts of those you form the deepest bonds with become your strength. That's not OC. OC has transfigured into Izanagi no Kami. Doesn't work now. Nope. Miss. Yep. What? Impossible. Can the will of so few surpass the will of all mankind? Honestly, no. How can your powers rival mine? Truths. Well, this is an OC. The word of power that banishes all the world's curses and falsehoods. All right, until like a couple years from now, and Persona Five happens. All right, here we go. Do 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 do. That was pretty cool.
This can't be. How could I be defeated? How am I the one to disappear? Instead of the endless struggle, wouldn't it be easier to wrap oneself in lies and live in blissful ignorance? Isn't that true peace for humans? How many times do we have to tell you? The hell with that shit! Stop assuming you know us! <laughs> Very well. Then try and live your way. Anyone else side with the villain sometimes in these games? Where you're just listening to the protagonist say shit and you're just like, wow, you're so dumb. <laughs> this is, it just sounds so hollow and naive. You know, like, it just, I guess because they're just all fighting for the wrong reasons. It's just like, Kanji says that, and I'm just like, do you even know what you're saying? Like, like could the gods say anything at this point, and you would just respond with, no, you, you know? Like, it's just... Power enough to erase my existence. You have already exceeded what I thought humanity to be capable of. You have lifted the fog in this world, as well as the fog in your own. And whether that will lead to happiness or not rests upon your shoulders. Children of man, well done. I'm not owned, by the way. I just want to let you know, well done, congratulations, GG no re, not owned at all right now, choosing to die. Glad that you did it. Fight wasn't real. Really over now. Yep, this time it's all over. Yeah, but we said that the last six times, and there was still something else that happened. It seems this is more like a beginning for us, though. Oh, for fuck's sake, Naoto. Well, now we've got no regrets for tomorrow. Can you just recap what happened? Friends that you can believe in, and many people you have come to understand. A strong heart bound to others, trying to ascertain the truth. A firm belief in grasping the truth through your own hands without being misled or deceived. The power of these things has brought judgment down on what deceived mankind. Open the door to a new tomorrow. Rank 10 with the fucking Scooby Gang. Hitting the booze, huh? Welcome back. Everything's finally over. Oh, man. I didn't notice the forehead until now. You really are incredible. I'm no match for you. You just fought the other me that split from my personality. Oh, this is awkward then. The two Sagiri. The other me, and the me that is speaking with you right now. What about the I? They were all originally one within me. Oh, okay. But there was nothing I could have done without my powers. If not for you, I would have disappeared along with the fog when the hollow forest vanished. Thank you so much. You saved everything. I'll be all right. The fragments you defeated have returned to me and will soon become one. My name is Izanami no Mikoto. I'm Waffles. The fertile will that protects those who live in this land and fulfills their wishes. Waffles chat upon. I will not forget you. Please do not forget. I am always by your side. Why was your poetry so bad then? <laughs> How marvelous. You have driven back a godly being and brought about a new world. This will be the last time we summon you here. Soon, the fog will lift and our destination will be visible. We will be arriving shortly. Is that what all this was about? We couldn't see where we were going? All right. Time to enlist some people to clear the fog. This fucking fog. This journey was a fruitful one. 
worthy of marking a turning point in your destiny. And then you, it pans out and they pull up to a Burger King drive through Yeah, a chicken sandwich, please. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Is the milkshake machine broken? Yeah, of course it is. Oh, well, I'll come back next time. Many a time along the way did the fog of lies prevent you from moving forth. Yet in every instance, you overcame the temptation of easy exits and false terminals. I think we hit all of them, bud. In forging bonds with those precious to you, you move closer to the truth, one step at a time. And my heart danced with delight to see you succeed. You stole that joke from Shrek 3. It's from Shrek 2, actually. I didn't steal it. I just forgot it happened in there. Yeah. I am most honored to have borne witness to such a wondrous journey. Our destination is close at hand now. Well then, we have finally come to your journey's true end. Our contract has been fulfilled. My own duties end here as well. You were truly a remarkable guest. Okay, do we just leave to the ending now and then to the train scene? Or is it like, does he come back later? Like, please don't have another fucking shitty go talk to everyone in town epilogue horse shit. Like, we already did that. More than once. Now, go forth and see with your own eyes. All right. See the world you have won. The bright, magnificent future. Ooh. All right, where are we? Yeah, flowers. Great vegetables. The fog is all gone. Wow. It's nice. Feels kind of nostalgic. I know this place. This scenery. A long, long time ago, everywhere in this world used to look like this. Doubt. Town's fog and the fog from the other world have all been clear. The human heart has the strength to shine through the clouds of the lies of uncertainty. You and your friends were able to prove that fact, and that will remain true until the end of time. Except for Persona 5. Credits? God, fuck, you know. Yo. Well, this is it. You really are leaving, huh? It hasn't really hit me yet. No more senpai from t tomorrow on. <laughs> it's the same scene. Hey, quit crying. It's way too soon for that. But, but. <laughs> Sheesh. Um, that, that stuff's kind of contagious, you know. We gotta put on a good face for senpai. Promise that you wouldn't cry. Building a case against a dachi is going pretty smoothly. There haven't been any more incidents since then. Inaba's finally back to its normal, peaceful self. And Nanako's better now, too. I couldn't ask for anything more. 
Thanks for everything. You're welcome. To me, you're just as much a part of this family as Nanako. I'm really glad you came to stay with us. Great visit. Sensei, I finally found a place for me. That's why I'm going back over there. Oh. To make sure it never goes wrong again. I'm going to protect that world from now on. That's different. I can finally be proud and say that world is where I belong. Man, Senpai. This town's gonna feel empty without no you. No one gives a shit. How cruel! <laughs> Were you even listening? We can see you anytime we want, you dork. Like you'll be gone long. Soon as you start craving something like ice cream, you'll be back in a flash. C come on, my honeys. Laughing that way isn't very cute, you know. You're just gonna be going in and out of the TV at Juness. How's that different from what you've been doing? What happens when they run out of TVs? Um, I can't quite decide what to do. At first, I only planned on staying here until the case was completely closed. Maybe I should stick to my original plan and take the train back with you, Senpai. Whoa! Risei's gonna have a meltdown right now. <laughs> Kidding, of course. I couldn't do something like that. Unless... It's not as though we'll never see each other again. Unless... Feel free to call me anytime, even if there isn't a case to solve. Nato's like, what if what if I put my fog realm bed next to yours? Just kidding. I don't feel like saying goodbye either. Then don't, bud. Hey, you got any plans during the long holiday in May? If you're free, come over and visit. Uh, I have to check with my other friends. With no mysteries to solve, we can have some real fun. I'll make reservations now so that we can stay in my family's inn. Someone just said train all. Because <laughs> they're going to be on a train. can get my revenge for that night. Our surprise <laughs> sneak attack will work for sure this time. Fucking hell. Don't bring that up, you stupid bear. Hey, what happened to going back to that world? That has nothing to do with this. It's entirely different. <laughs> that reminds me, she's not here. I would have thought that she would come today at least. Are you talking about Marie? I was wondering about that too. Huh? What? Who are you talking about? Oh, you mean Marie-chan, right? Oh yeah. I haven't seen her ever since... Oh. Is she doing okay? I think so. I'm pretty sure she's fine. She's in our hearts. She's in our hearts. supposed to mean oh so emmy chan went back there huh oh my i've got a hottie for a neighbor now what should i do oh is that what you meant oh i thought something bad had happened to her oh no she's dead for sure why'd you have to say it like that well as long as she's doing well that's okay thank you and counting for the five month reset thank you very much and thank you julia Whites for the hundred bits as well. Almost said a waltz instead of whites. That would have been bad. Thank you, Julia. Hey, stop ignoring me. But back to a serious note, she should have at least shown up here since this is the last time we'll see you. What do you mean? Oh. <gasps> Say things like that too. It's almost time. You better get on the train. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Come back anytime you want. We can eat ramen again. 
Me and Daisuke will definitely come crash at your place someday. So fucking awkward. <laughs> Well, see ya. Good luck over there, too. If anything happens on your end, we'll come running. Until we meet again. Chili looks so cute in the, uh, in the anime scenes, huh? See ya. Take care. I'll be looking forward to seeing you again. Well, be careful. I'll see you, big bro. Bye-bye. Yes, cry for me. Yes. Run faster. Yes, prove your love. You better not run away too, senpai. Distance doesn't matter to us. Even if we're separated, we're still friends. Oh, we're coming back. All right. He's really gone. Oh, no, we're not. It's sad that he won't be around, but we will be okay. Right, guys? Doesn't matter how far apart we are. Teddy's going to go evil now. So he has a reason to come back. Strong. That's why I did this. Everyone's That's why I killed them all, senpai. To the people they know and trust. A reason to stay. It's those bonds that let us all search for our purpose in life. As long as it's a purpose you believe in. There will always be someone who can help you fulfill it. You, me, and everyone else. There are no barriers. Just tear the far left off of that Our photo, hearts Waffles. Are one. Right, Sensei? Do, do, do. Are we done? How are we not done? What? <sighs> what? Summer vacation. The town doesn't seem to have changed at all since last time. I have seen the light. I've learned the most important lesson from the events last year. A man you've seen before is delivering a passionate address to the crowd. Unfortunately, this world is full of things meant to deceive people. This world isn't perfect. The things you do in pursuit of justice may actually be a terrible mistake. One man is not enough to judge these things. It was a group of boys and girls who taught me that. In their spirit, I want to join hands with all of you to rethink this town's future. I want Inaba to be a town free from deceit and distractions that keep you from focusing on the things most important to you. Hey kid, do you know who that is? I don't care. Don't you remember? He was the one they arrested during those awful murders last year. Yeah, I don't care. And now he's running for mayor. That was a surprise. Uh huh. He's so passionate though. At first no one wanted to go near him, but look at him now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he killed my cousin. I've been to a few of his speeches. I think he might be a pretty nice guy. Mm -hmm. He killed my cousin. If we can all work together on this and not get so sidetracked by passing trends, this town will regain its former glory. So please, lend me your strength. Please. Now Tommy's speech continues. So Adachi presumably went to prison. Why didn't Namatami go to prison? Nobody seems to be here to welcome you. Like, if they could prove Adachi's involvement, shouldn't Namatami go to prison too? It was still kidnapping and attempted murder. Well, no, not attempted murder. Attempted something. Gross negligence, something like that. I don't know, you decided to go to the Jima's residence.
There's no answer. The front door is locked. They seem to be away. We decide to call Dojima. Hello? Oh! Oh! <clears throat> it's you, huh? Did you not know I was coming? Oh yeah. You're, uh, you're coming over. Was... Was that today? Sorry, but my hands are tied right now. Aw, oh, typical Dojima. There's no way this is a surprise party, but no. Yeah, alright. Why don't you call one of your friends and hang out with them for a bit? I'll see you later. Alright, see ya. Dojima seems busy. You decide to call Yosuke. I'm busy too. Yosuke isn't answering either. Did something happen? Alright, well, can't be helped. I'm going home. Into a central shopping district, you don't see anyone you know. Hey, what do you think of beefsteak onigiri? We can freeze it and sell it nationwide through amazing commodities. Bada bada. I don't know. Those are handmade, aren't they? I don't think we can mass produce them. On the other hand, maybe limited quantities and handmade are good selling points that could revitalize this town. I thought of moving away once, but I don't think I could bear to be away from here. I understand completely. This is where we were born and raised. <laughs> okay, Oblivion NPCs. What the fuck is this shit? Fucking full-on Moncton. What? We'll have to work together if we don't want it to fall apart. <laughs> Great news! Judas said we'll have their full cooperation! <laughs> yes! Good thing we went to talk with them. If only we'd done it sooner. But... What are we supposed to sell in a locally produced goods section? I guess the steak kebabs are good, but what other stuff is there? We're not famous for anything else. Don't give me anything, you half-wit! Vegetable, fish, even ramen! As long as it's something we put our backs into, it'll sell like hotcakes! You gotta work hard so you don't embarrass your nest! We can't be weak now! The shopping district is coming alive. You decide to go to Juness, where every day is great. Juness Fuku. I thought for sure the party was a Juness. All right. Oh, it is. Y Yosuke's there hiding. Okay. You don't see anyone you know. Ow! You're going to give us away, idiot. Only because you were slow, slow like a jar of molasses. <laughs> Shut up, he's going to hear. Ah, oh, we blew it. Oh well, here goes. One, two. Happy birthday. Wah! Bah! It's a bear. Wait, did Waffles have a birthday? This isn't anything like we planned. And what's with the bar? It's a bear. Oh, you make it sound like we're the ones getting ambushed. Is her hair different? Who the fuck is this math teacher in the background? What? I knew we'd run into snags. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No. Uh, we heard you were coming, so we planned a little surprise. I mean, things got kind of nuts when you last visited in May. We thought instead of you coming to each of our houses, we'd spice things up this time. Yeah, and we thought you'd miss us a little if you couldn't find any of us. It didn't go quite like we planned, but it's been a while, senpai. Whoa, Harry Potter, how's it going? Were you surprised? Oh, Yukiko looks older. Yeah, surprise, it, it was such a failure. <laughs> what on earth are you wearing? <laughs> oh, you mean Kanji-kun, right? Well... <laughs> <laughs> Don't mention Kanji-kun! Yukiko won't stop laughing! 
Yeah. Will you asshats lay off? You're getting a little rude there. <laughs> well, we have all changed a little. None of us can remain in stasis forever. <laughs> what does Ar what does Arcanine evolve into? Oh, stop laughing already. None of us want to be the guy who's always talking about how great things were back in the day. As long as we're all here, keeping an eye out for each other, we can change. Yosuke's still a show-off. Not me, though. I'm different now. Why, I've powered up so much that I'm probably a grizzly bear. Huh. Sounds powerful. I'll stick you with all the manual labor then. Alright, are we gonna sit down and talk about how there's something about this, the case that we forgot about now and another dungeon? <laughs> oh, hi. It's me. Did the surprise go well? Yeah, it's still ongoing. Were you in on it? <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, that's good. Sorry, they asked for my help, so I acted like I wasn't home when you came by. Very believable. I'm a pro when it comes to seeing through a lie, but when I'm the one who has to put on an act, I don't last five seconds. Anyway, bring them all back here. I've got a good meal waiting. Great vegetables. He told everyone that Ajima is waiting. Oh, really? Let's eat. Hey, Kanji, this is to celebrate Senpai coming back. Shut up, I know. Shouldn't Risei be out doing idle things? Or did she come back at the same time? You decided to go to the Jima residence with the others. Is this still going? Holy fuck. <laughs> oh, so good. Jason, by that's your second one. We get one each, remember? Thank you, TFS Big D Danny Glide. Always fun to say that name. Thank you very much for the six month resub. Thank you, Anton1699 for the 100 bits. And thank you, Dr. Legs. Oh man, Dr. Legs coming in with a resub right at the end of Persona 4. Poetry. Thank you very much, Dr. Legs, for the 38 month resub. You kids sure eat a lot. I thought I might have ordered too much, but look at you, plowing through it already. Sorry about that, and thanks. Isn't Nanako-chan here? I'd hate to eat her share too. She's a piano lessons. Don't worry, I set hers aside. Oh, didn't I tell you? Yeah, Nanako started learning the piano. She should be back any time now. I'm sure she'll be rushing home. Ever since she found out you'd be back, it's all she's talked about. Kojima is laughing. I'm glad she's, she's doing well. Yeah, me too. She's growing and learning every day. It's an amazing thing to see. Just watching her gives me strength. It's slow, but I'm moving on, bit by bit. Oh, you, you've been around to see it. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, what, what about your wife? Is that just never resolved? Because I thought that was going somewhere. Actually, I came across some information about an old hit and run incident. Oh yeah, which one? The victim was Chisato Dojima, my wife. I've been chasing dead ends and false leads for so long. But I think I'm finally getting close to the truth. Just when I thought I'd keep my personal feelings separate from my job. <laughs> That's strange. It was a dachi somehow. Though, it's thanks to you that I was able to draw that line in the first place. Thank you. Isn't that neat and tidy? Anything else new? What happened with last year's case? Oh, that? Well, I don't know if you heard already, but Namatame got released on lack of evidence. Okay, but Adachi got convicted with evidence? I can't tell you too much, but basically no one could reproduce his supposed methods, not even Namatame himself. Alright. He was very insistent on the details of his crimes, but a diary isn't enough evidence to build a case on. Alright, so a confession wasn't enough for, for Namatame, but it was enough for Adachi? Adachi conf- So did Namatame! He came to me to apologize. But I told him he should come up with his own way to make up for it. He said he was gonna run for mayor. I don't know how serious he was about that. Great mayor! Oh, so that was Namatame-san giving those speeches. Oh yeah. And I went to see Adachi. What happened to him? 
Were you the one to interrogate him? No, I wasn't part of that. I couldn't be. We were too close. But he was indicted. It was probably just circumstantial evidence, but he said a lot of things only the real killer could know. Real. After they set a trial date for him, I was able to go see him. I see. Now it's time he was a remorseful. Ah, uh, if that's the case, then it's all right that he kidnapped multiple people and killed Nanako. If he if he feels bad about it, then all right. I guess he doesn't need to go to prison for that. They say he's a model prisoner. The bastard says he gets better treatment behind bars than he did when he was working with me. Classic Adachi. Huh. Next time I go see him, I'll bring him a cheap cabbage. Cheap vegetable. Kojima looks happy. I'm home! Aww. Dad! Is Big Bro? Big Bro! <laughs> Surprise, Nanako? Welcome home, Nana chan! Teddy, too? And Risei chan! <laughs> Everyone's here! What, they haven't been visiting? I'm learning piano now, and I've been a good girl! I'm proud of you. Calm down. <laughs> Calm down, piano. I'm proud of you. <laughs> I'll play for you sometime. I didn't think she'd ask to start piano lessons. Like mother, like daughter, I guess. Chisato was a piano teacher, but Nanako's pretty good herself. At first, I didn't even want to hear the word piano. Now that she wants to learn, I gotta get over it. I remember what my mom played. I'm gonna play it for you, Dad. Dad, the weather report's on. Oh no. And now, the weather. It was nice and sunny today, but what will it look like after that? Take it away, Mariko. Hello, Mariko Kasumi here. Oh, for fuck's sake. <sighs> We've been having a lot of rain recently, so starting today, I'm gonna make it sunny. I mean, after all that rain, I don't think we're gonna have to worry about any water shortages this summer. <laughs> And besides, someone's visiting. I can't have it rain while he's here, so I'm gonna keep it sunny for a while. All right, thanks for that awkward fucking weather report. Mariko? Mariko, please calm down. Oh, but if it gets too hot, then some rain should be fine. He should tell me whenever he wants it different, and I'll change it. Just like that. The weather forecaster is Mar Wait, that's Marie? What? to mention she's been coming here a lot she's famous now how'd she get so popular so fast what was the station thinking her stage name's so boring too this girl will decide tomorrow's weather right <laughs> <laughs> all right that's a really really good callback all right i gotta give props for that that was that was really good all right, well done. Whenever she says it's gonna be sunny, the sun comes out. Uh, in her case, maybe. Thanks, Mariko. Tell our viewers goodbye. I hope you all have a good day tomorrow. Remember, the more you put in, the more you get out. What about the more you put out? The more you get out. I see that weather girl a lot. The more you put out, the more you get in. The younger ones at the station tell me they feel motivated whenever she does that. I'm not surprised. It's just a coincidence. I feel it a little myself, to be honest. Well, I'm just glad the weird fog is gone. Now we don't have to obsess over the weather report. It is really great, though. Everyone in town is more motivated. Yeah! People have so much energy now. You're right. It doesn't wear you down walking through town anymore. Not like last year. Everyone has a more positive outlook on life than when I first came. It shows people can change. For better or worse, I guess. Depends on your perspective. After the fog lifted, I'm sure people just realized that it's a lot brighter when your eyes are open. 
There's a lot we'd rather not see. A lot of grime in the human heart. But if you close your eyes to everything, you can't even see the people close to you. How can you be happy like that? The only thing to do, really, is to keep marching on, straight ahead. I'm rambling, aren't I? <laughs> Guess I had more to drink than I thought. I feel like I entered a fugue state 30 minutes ago. I, I don't really know what's happening right now. Maybe two hours ago. Oh yeah, Nanako, didn't you say there was something you wanted to tell him when he came home? Oh, there's another letter. Your cooking is barely food, Chie. Hey, shut up! What about yeah, mine? Cold, I could have made something uh, too. Please don't. Hmm? Um, what was that? I can cook if I put my mind um, to it. Mm -hmm. So can I. Mm -hmm. That's... Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Gotcha. Hmm. Where's Shu? <laughs> Got it? Oh, uh, yeah! Uh, um, well then. One and... It's good to see you, senpai. Well, Kanji, it was welcome back. How could you mess that up? Hey, just shut up, all right? I just got stage fright, that's well, all. Well, I figured someone would blow it. How long is the post credit scene? If I had a, if I had a billion dollars to make a video game, I would make like a 500 to 1000 hour long game and I would just keep it would just keep ending and then just keep going to another part after it and you would never know like <laughs> just forever <laughs> this has got to be the real ending now, right? Like no, nope, there's another 400 hours left. It just keeps fucking going. <laughs> Like, like too many fucking cooks. Like, this is fucking. And with the profits, you could continually patch the game and make a lot. There'd, there'd be no profits. Found out some Persona 4, Joe. Uh, I said my piece yesterday during the the credits yesterday. Uh, I don't really want to repeat myself because you know. If, you, if, you, if you're watching now, or if you're on watching the VOD, or you're watching on YouTube, it eventually goes on YouTube. Like, you probably watched it in order to get to this point, right? Um, so, I don't know, like, this, this ending felt really unnecessary to me, and... Again, just lots and lots and lots of pacing issues. I hate to harp on about pacing issues, because usually pacing issues don't bother me all that much, to be honest. But, um, I like Reese's new hair. Uh, but, like, it's been two experiences back-to-back -back that have had, uh, great pacing issues. So... Yeah. Milkshake, please. Yeah. Now they know you're in here. Asking what we were having for food. Busted. Yeah. Fucking busted. Yeah. 
Anyway, it has, it has pacing problems, but I feel like I wouldn't care about the pacing problems if the interactions that the characters had were better written and more more engaging. Again, I hate to repeat, I repeat myself, you know, uh, especially considering this isn't one of my videos. Um, try to keep the repetition down on the streams compared to the videos. Uh, it's just like, I feel like a lot of the filler interactions that the characters had were better than the structured ones during social links. Uh, and I would have loved to have more interactions like when they went to the when they went to the bar and they got fake drunk and when they went snowboarding like those interactions I wouldn't say I, like I love those but those were those were much better you know having the whole team interact with things when they're actually they're doing something instead of just sitting around talking about their fucking feelings you know like that's that's good stuff, right? But it's also more expensive. You have to have different uh, locations and have different animations of what they're doing and different assets of them being in costume and everything. So, like, I, there are budget restraints, but I feel like they could have done it better still, you know? Just having them interact with Juness even more would have been better, or just... I don't know. Which end do you like the most? The one where we throw Namatami into the TV. It's, like... It cuts the game short to about the length it should have been. Like, it's still not great, but it cuts the game short where it's been. It's kind of dark. There are consequences to your actions and everything. Um, that feels like a round where it, sh it should end if it was better properly paced. Uh, like, it's not satisfying. There's a lot of things that are left unresolved, obviously, so it's not perfect, you know? But, I don't know. I, f I felt like it was like, oh, wow, that, that was dark. Someone sent me a DM saying, I hope I'm allowed to share this, like, like it was sent to me anonymously, so like I'm not saying the name. Someone sent me a DM, I didn't respond to them, so they're probably surprised that I read it. I try to read all my DMs, but I don't always respond. Um, they said that uh, they, their, their girlfriend or their wife played the game when it first came out and was very surprised at how dark the ending was because she got that ending and didn't realize there was another one. So for years she thought that was it. That that was that was the ending. Wow. And she played it again and got the same ending and and like it was so like she had that conversation with 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 uh with her boyfriend or husband who was like like no, there's a whole other part after that. And, and I, you know? I I kind of like that, you know? Like it still fits. Do 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 do. There we go. Finny. Oh, this one's harder to edit. Oh, Marie's there that time. Save clear data. So that took us 115 hours, 116 hours. So I think that's shorter than Persona 5, isn't it? Or, hmm, close to it. I can't remember what our final playtime was for Persona 5. All right, so that's it. Oh. Plus reloads, oh yeah, that's true. Excuse me, how many reloads did we do? Did we, we had at least one major reload today. Uh, that was like, what, half an hour? Was there one before that too? Okay. So the thing with uh, the Jima's wife is still like completely unresolved. I really thought that would I was gonna get a resolution. Maybe they thought they were gonna have like a sequel or a spinoff or something. Maybe maybe it is there. Hmm, I don't know. Do, do, do. Summer vacation. A shocking incident with a young man upon his return to fog clearing town. Fog clear town. Do, 
do all right so here's the things that persona 4 does better than persona 5. i like the setting marginally better in persona 4. uh i think kanji is probably the best character out of both games dojima might be the most fleshed out of character in both games i really like shuffle time um obviously the music tracks are gonna go back and forth uh, i like that they introduced the final party member early enough into the story that uh, you actually had time to see them all interact with each other and also interact with that party member Whereas they introduce the last party member persona 5 way too close to the end uh, You still do get to have uh, a fair amount of time with the last party member persona 5, but um, Not as much as I think you should you know like um, I'm trying to think of anything else The school felt about the same, the teachers and those interactions felt about the same. I like that you didn't get shamed for giving the wrong answer because that just didn't seem right in Persona 5. Um... <sighs> I think that's it. Adachi versus Shido. Shido has more of a presence as a villain. Adachi is introduced as this big like whoa and then just is just dropped and it doesn't go anywhere. It's really weird. The mystery of this game is very strange. Like I don't even know if I'd call it outright bad. It's just strange. It just it just it's, it doesn't have a good reason for being a mystery and then after it's brought out it's like oh and that's it. That's the end. It's like okay, like what? Like hmm, I don't know. Very confusing. Who has the better protagonist? Oh, uh, Joker for sure. Joker's way better than, than uh, Hero here. Yeah. Uh, I feel like this is way more of a blank slate. From what I've uh, gathered from reading people in chat and what has been said to me, uh, people conflate the anime protagonist with the game's protagonist and kind of like impose a lot of that personality onto the game's protagonist. If you're just looking at game versus game, like Joker has way more of a presence and way more of, of, a, of a personality that shows with the interactions and the choices you make. You know, like even, even just like the, the, the animations and, and what they do during the scenes, just, just way more. Um, it, that's not necessarily a good thing. Like, like if you prefer more of the, like the passive blank state protagonist that you might prefer, uh, this one to, to Persona 5s. But, um, if we're comparing waffles, like I'm dad upon all the way over chat upon, although I had a lot of fun being a complete massive psychopathic asshole, uh, through chat upon, maybe you have those options in dad upon too. And I just didn't take them, but like, holy shit, like just, like, damn, I'm surprised at how how much of a prick you can be uh, through some of the options. It's really fun. Haru Arise? Uh, as, as a character, who's more interesting? I really like Risei's forwardness, you know? I, I really like that all the other girls are kind of like, hee hee, I can't really talk about my feelings, and oh, this is the first time I've ever hung out with a boy, and, and oh, it can't be helped, and all this other shit, you know? Like, oh, are, are, are we kissing? Well, I guess I could let that happen, whereas Risei's like, hold up your hand if you have naughty thought, you know? Like, Risei, Risei's very forward, and, and uh, particularly amongst anime, I find that very refreshing from what we've seen in all the anime shit. Um, you know, like Risei knows what she wants and she's going for it. So I like that. Uh, but Haru, Haru is kind of like, like kind of hee you know, like the kind of, kind of meek sort of archetype that a lot of uh, the girls tend to be in in these games. Uh, I can't remember what On was like with with Joker. I remember On's romance coming kind of out of nowhere with Joker. It just felt like they were friends right until oh my god, romance time, you know. Uh, so maybe that's why I like Risei too. Like Risei is like like romance the whole time so it feels natural to have a romance with Risei when it comes up and Haru I felt like was a lot more flirting a lot more connections being made during the interactions whereas with the others it was like just hanging out being really good friends and then all of a sudden she she's like I want to be more than friends and it's like oh shit um whereas Haru I felt was more flirt flirtatious and there was more going back and forth there um hmm do 
What would you think of Risa's interactions if you didn't date her? Probably annoying. I'd be like, you know, be gone. Like, I'm with Yukiko, right? Yeah, I think that's probably a big flaw of, of Persona 4 is how it doesn't react to your romance choice. Because that seems to be important. You know, the, the re it's all about social links and gaining bonds, right? So I think it's a shame that they didn't um, do that. I understand it would have been uh, expensive and difficult to do, but uh, the game also didn't need to be 100 hours long. So like, I think I would very much like to see a Persona game that is only 50 hours long. Like I, I know only, like 50 hours is still like a hell of a long game. Um, but you know, if they if they would if they could cut the game in half and have a lot more reactions to what you can do, uh, I think I would be interested in seeing how that works. Do, 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 do. I wonder what the what the goal is because like no one makes a game this long without having a really good reason to do it. So, like, what is the purpose of the game being so drawn out and long? Do they think that they need a lot of interactions with the characters to, to, um, to, uh, you know, settle in with them so you can, so you feel the bond growing? Or is it just they had an idea for a certain amount of dungeons and then they were like, okay, well, now let's fill it up with social links or something? Hmm, I wonder. I'm guessing that the development process in these games is a fucking mess. But that's true for almost any big project to be honest but like I wonder if it's more of a mess than usual to make you live a whole school year yeah maybe that's it too and it's like okay it's gonna be one year so right from the beginning it's like one year and you need something to do most days it's like okay so now we need to fill it in yeah maybe maybe it's not afraid to skip you forward sometimes though Golden add a lot too. Yeah, if I had infinite time, I would like to play the game without Golden, so I could see what exactly they added. Uh, maybe there's like a comparison video somewhere. Someone someone's gone through it and has has made like a, a list of all the things. I'd like a breakdown of that. <sighs> Someone's asking about Persona Three again. Uh, if Persona Three gets a remaster, we'll play it. If it gets like a Switch release, yeah, for sure we'll play it. If that happens before uh, we're done with the voted games, we'll play it before Persona Five Royal. If not, then the next Persona game we'll play will be Royal, and then we'll go to Strikers, and that's what we'll do. Anyway, I'm really tired, and uh, apparently food is coming. So let me say some quick thank yous, and then I'll like say one final thing, and then we'll go. Thank you, Millis Faro, for the 1113 sub. Thank you very much. Thank you, Molecular Clock, for the new sub. Thank you very much. Thank you, Fitz Fitzky, for the 513 sub. Thank you very much, Fitzky. Thank you, Utemp Utemp 6 for the 15 month resub. Thank you, Will Do It Live, or Well Do It Live 3, for the 5 month resub. Thank you, P Mass Trip. Polito for the 200 bits. Hopefully that's somewhere close. Yeah, it's gotta be that. Thank you, All Rounder Gaming, for the uh, 613 sub, and thank you, Phoenix Furion, for gifting a sub to you. Done, you done, and that's it. I am done. Uh, I will be back uh, streaming when uh, the Cyberpunk video is done and the Witcher 3 video is done, and also when things settle here after uh, the new baby arrives. So. Uh, the new baby is uh, due at the end of May now, um, so it could could come earlier. We'll see. Uh, but yeah, I have I have two videos to make. The Starpunk video should be out fairly soon. Uh, I haven't been managing my time very well with all the streams and shit, so um, uh, that should be busted out. And then Witcher three video, and then if that coincides with things settling down after the baby being born, uh, we will we'll, we'll, we will be back. Uh, but if not, um, we'll see how long it takes. I have no idea. It could be two months, could be more than that. I don't know. We'll see. But uh, I might do a stream here and there just to check in and say, hey, uh, if E3 happens before I come back, I will stream E3. Uh, and yeah, when, so when streams are back for sure, the Witcher project will finally be behind us. Um, and I will be a new man. That's what we're going to do. Uh, and that's it. So thank you for watching me play Persona 4. Hopefully it lived up to some expectations for Persona 5. I know some people will have preferred this playthrough the Persona 5 playthrough. Um, some people will always prefer the Persona 5 playthrough. I don't know which is better. It's probably too long for me to look back on. If someone makes a highlight video, maybe I'll compare that to the one that uh, Papa John's made on YouTube and see what the highlight was. And that's it. Anyway, thank you much everybody. Uh, have a good uh, couple months until I see you next.
Take care. All the best. Hopefully, COVID will be mostly behind us by then. Like, vaccinations are being rolled out pretty quickly. Oh, thank you, Heart Trip, for the 16 month resub. Thank you very much. Just came in right now. Thank you very much. Thank you for watching. See you later. Oh, that was too sudden, wasn't it? Oh, no. Oh, no. That's awkward. Well, that's fitting.